Hello, I am Dr. Lee Vickers, author of Bodies of Light and founder of Light Workers International, and this is... Cynthia Siegel, and I'm about to become your new favorite psychic. And Vitaly Okri, one future, one breath, plug into your one future and become one with the universe. And the subject today <laughs> is how you are going to survive a toxic environment. And as part of this, I need to do a waiver. Bodies of Light is not meant to cure, treat, or diagnose any disease. Revelations of the Light are uh, pure freedom of religion and freedom of speech. And this is medical treatment in no way, shape, or form. Now, that being said, <laughs> okay, you may not know how toxic your environment truly is, and you might not know what it's doing to you, and you might not know that it could possibly be killing it. How could you know? Right? Until now. Until now. <laughs> See, a, a lot of people, you know, they, they hear the scare tactics of, well, there's this is toxic and preservatives and chemicals and, and, and the, the, the pollution from the cars and the smokestacks and the pesticides. And so basically, I think people get, uh, get a, they just for, forget to even check anything because they're afraid of everything. Yeah, this just right. goes like, well, it's so much of it all around us. I mean, it's, you know, there's barely anything good. So I just give it up and, you know, stop checking and just get it. You know, hopefully everything's going to be fine later on. And then, of course, other people get psychotic about it. And then they're reading every little label and checking every little research. And, of course, the companies, they'll change the name. So if all of a sudden uh, corn syrup becomes corn sugar, and then they change this chemical to that name. and that, So everyone's always... <laughs> like you know kind of following around trying to find out what it is and then they keep you know the companies that are making it of course that are getting bad karma and all this are, are trying to oh let's change the name so they don't recognize it yes yeah. right i like the the new one that's um all natural yeah and you can call a super deadly chemical all natural even though they it took something that was natural and processed it to the point where it was totally toxic mm -hmm. yes right yes so what do, they, what do they do? I mean, what's the hope of living in a toxic environment and, and surviving? I mean, what, what, you know, how, can, how would you ever survive that? By reading everything, every single label is not going to help much because you know, they're still not putting up everything that you have to know on those labels, even though some countries start to, to, to ban different companies that are trying to put up labeling that is actually going to specify indicate what exactly you're consuming in, in, in your body mm -hmm. and the, the other thing like we said before the all natural you know like all organic and even organic really, yes right even the, a lot of some of the organics are actually very very toxic and actually how do you know from the time the seed was planted till you actually put it on your table everyone that's handled it and what their health was yeah you know it, it the thing is is that your only hope is to do bodies of light and to learn how to test the energy of the food, which of course we call the chi of food, which is the energy of the food and the energy of what's around you. And there's, there's more things out there that, uh, that are toxic and deadly that you could ever shake a stick at. Would you, would you and agree? Yeah. there's still a lot of great stuff that you can eat and have and use on your body and in your body. Right. I think, I think we can say one thing, like uh, if you go to, let's say, to the grocery store and all of a sudden you see, or all of a sudden you just start to dig in in this huge pile of, let's say, oranges, you start to dig in, you, somehow you're not grabbing the first that sits right on top of it. Somehow you're just trying to dig in all the way, all the way inside. And of course, those clerks around the store are getting a little upset over that. But why do you dig in all the way down? Mm. What makes you to go so far to reach out for your fruit? and not grab the first one that sits right on top, the easier to grasp. Yeah, so why would the one on top not feel so great? Why would it weaken you? Of course, we're coming now into the basis of uh, buys of light testing things yeah. and the basis of uh, the chi of food, which testing. is testing. Muscle right. Test. right, so. And the, the same thing with the first can on the shelf. Right. Yeah. Why do people reach behind to get that can? Right. Because, you know, you know why you reach it up right behind it, but you just somehow you're not able to explain it 
yet, but somehow you're trying to get that something is more protected in a bag that is far from a reach from regular person to pass by and just, you know, to spit up all this possibly, you know, maybe sickness, bacteria, bacteria, viruses, which you don't understand, those, yeah. those fruit, those things in the front, you have people that have walked in front of it and they put bacteria, viruses, they put things on the can. So then you touch the can and open it up and then you put it in the can and then you wonder why you really don't want that front can or that top piece of fruit. And, and, and sometimes there is a piece of fruit down there, but how are you gonna find it? How are you gonna know that down there is a piece of fruit that's good, but this one is, is bad? Also, you'll notice it'll have a number of rows of fruit, and then a few of the rows will be super deadly. They could even be organic. And then you have some of the other ones maybe aren't even organic, and yet they're super healing, and you hold it, and there's so much vibrance. Mm -hmm. Right? And that, that it would be amazingly healing for you. How can anyone find that out? I know we had an uh, 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 amazing uh, son who was helping his mom and he was like going and buying a bunch of stuff. And, and like all of them but one product tested deadly. Right? And so it was, it's interesting how, and of course you, you didn't know to check even further back. You were checking all the ones in the front. Right? Yeah. And so the thing is, is that how are you going to know how to do this? Uh, the first piece, of course, is that you can only test up to how high you are. Now, the secret in that is if your energy is low, if you're tired and your, your energy is low, then you can't do the energy testing because if you're a zero, you can only test up to a zero, meaning... That everything's going to be a zero. Yeah. It's going to be no, 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 cannot, 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 cannot. cannot. So, so if you fine? test everything and everything's a zero, your energy is low. Right? I remember one time being in a grocery store, and so I'm taking on the energy of everyone in the store, but everything that I tested was a 200 until I remembered to check myself, and nice. I was a 200. Right. So I can't go higher than that. So anything that was good, you're only testing up to a 200. Yeah. So you got to understand that this is double blind. In all this that we're showing you right now, we're showing you the next great leap for mankind. Not only is it in testing your foods, what you drink, uh, the people you hang around, um, and everything in our environment, but you can choose your decisions. Like what we are literally plugging into are your light abilities. What you got to realize is that you are an infinite being of light that has lived millions of years, thousands of lifetimes, and your energy used to be super, super powerful. You used to be able to look at a piece of fruit in a past life and be like, ugh, and know immediately that wasn't good for you because you were so bright. Now, the problem is you've become so dim and so tired and so exhausted. And as a light being, you're so weak and so low and so have no energy that you don't know the difference between that piece of fruit that would make you feel amazing and that one that would drain you because everything is draining you because you're so drained. Which is why we've come to rely on reading and research. Yeah, so <laughs> what you'll notice is that when you do bodies of light, that, and you charge up your energetic field, that it automatically attracts things that are good for you, like an electromagnet. But also on the other side, is it repels things that would hurt you. Yes. It pushes them away. So you try to eat that rotten, rotten chicken wing, you, <coughs> you cough it out, right? I mean, how many times have, have I put something <coughs> and you see me or, like... Or even better than that, you're going somewhere, you're all dressed up in a white shirt, and all of a sudden you're trying to scoop it up something and, and you just, drop it. And it drops all the time, and you sure get it messed up because you're not testing it. Yeah. And you hurt yourself, you basically telling you, don't eat it, even if you want yes, it. Yes. Even if you or want you, it souffle or something. Or your so ego, <laughs> like, I'm trying to get that piece of butter. We were, we were trying to put it, and I'm like... <laughs> And it goes everywhere. <laughs> and I'm like, okay, okay, the butter's a negative 10, you know. And so you gotta understand there's is a light being, you have an internal guidance system that is gonna guide you away from things that are toxic and attract you towards things that were gonna heal you and gonna make you feel good 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Thank goodness. Yep. Yeah, so of course this all starts with what? With the light, with you. With the light, and you. And see, you have to open up your light. You have to do bodies of light in order to be able to test things, to do the cheat yeah. of food. Yeah. So we're just gonna go right into it. We'll do the God edition, which is like a very nice, easy edition of bodies of light. And you repeat at home so that your energy is high enough so that when we're doing the testing and, you, and we're going further, you're gonna be able to test it at home with us because your energy will go higher and you'll be able to test everything up to the level where you're at. So let's say we're going to give you something to test 
If you manage, you're gonna be at zero or 10. You'll find this is super healing products, actually super high, it's gonna be only up to 10 for you, which is not true. You have to raise up your energy, super discharge, and then we're gonna test all the good stuff for you so you can heal yourself and be your best life all the time. Right, so like what he's saying is like, if you're a 10 and we're saying, hey, this is a million, and then you're checking and it's a 10, you know, you may only be a 10. That's why you're getting a 10 at home and we're getting a million. We're, this is double blind, this is scientific. This is the next great leap. Bi and, and, and we also classify this under bioenergetics. But this is the next great leap for mankind. Imagine when millions of people can test, we're gonna start making better foods, yes. we're gonna be healthier, our DNA is gonna evolve to higher states of being. It's, we'll go into that later, but just hang on. It's what about potato wild. chips that heal you? The yeah. possibilities are endless. Yeah, I mean, can you imagine companies actually making foods that heal you because they know that, you're, that millions are gonna test it and uh -huh. that they can't fool you anymore. Right. Yeah. So this is what we're looking forward to. So let's do bodies of light and just repeat after, repeat after me. I am the temple of God. I am the temple, the temple of God. God. The light of God. The light of God dwells within me. Dwells within me. Each of my eight bodies. Each of my eight bodies contains zillions of intelligences. Contains zillions of intelligences. Here and now. Here and now. Directly connected. Directly connected to the light of God. To the light of God. I direct every aspect. I direct every aspect of my eight bodies. Of my eight bodies to turn upwards. To turn upwards. To the eternal light of God. To the, the eternal, eternal light, light of God. God. All of my eight chakras. All, all of my eight chakras. And bodies of being. And bodies of being. Are now fully open. Are now fully open. To the light of God. To the light of God. I am at one with God. I am at one with God. My spirit is awake. My spirit is awake. And fully open to God. And fully open to God. My spirit receives. My spirit receives. All divine communication. All divine communication. From God. From God. God's pure light. God's pure light shines upon every aspect. Shines upon every aspect of my etheric body. Of my etheric body. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. For your bells. For your bells. Of levitating power. Of levitating power. Raising me upwards toward the heavens. Raising me upwards towards the heavens and the infinitely powerful and the infinitely powerful blue shield blue shield of electromagnetic insulation of electromagnetic insulation which allows only the light of god within which, which allows only the light of god within my etheric body my etheric body my etheric body expresses perfect and appropriate expresses perfect and appropriate feelings and emotions feelings and emotions just one sec you have to be saying this out loud you have to be able to hear what you're saying for this to work. Yeah, you, so say it with us. Yeah, you got to say it in order to open up your energy to be able to do the testing. God's pure light. God's, God's pure light. Shines upon every aspect. Shines upon, upon every aspect. aspect. Of my astral body. Of my astral body. Be awake and alert. Be awake and alert. My astral body. My astral body. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. For easy and relaxed. For easy and relaxed. Astral travel. Astral travel. Perfect control. Perfect control. And spiritual peace. And spiritual peace. God's pure light. God's pure light. Shines upon every aspect. Shines upon every aspect. Of my mental body. Of my mental body. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. For accurate. Memory, for accurate memory, memory, appropriate intelligence, appropriate appropriate intelligence, intelligence proper, revelation, proper, proper revelation, and divine timing, and divine timing of righteous decisions. Of righteous righteous decisions. decisions. God's pure light. God's, God's pure light shines upon every aspect. Shines upon every aspect of my physical body. Of my physical body. This light shines. This light shines from above down, from above down and inside out. And inside out. Through every cell. Through every cell. Traveling from my brain. Traveling from my brain. Through my forehead and throat. Through my forehead and throat. Permeating all cells of my heart. Permeating all cells of my heart. Following every part. Following every part of my digestive system. Of my digestive. System. including my stomach including my stomach liver liver and intestines, and intestines. flowing from my cranium flowing from, from my cranium, cranium. Through, my through my spine to my spine to the sacral base to the sacral base creating divine stability creating divine stability, divine stability. through my arms and hands through my arms and hands legs and feet legs and feet I direct the light. I direct the light to charge. To charge my entire nervous system. My entire nervous system and shine. And shine through every blood cell. Through every blood cell, creating perfect. Creating perfect homeostasis. Homeostasis. All cells. All cells composing my physical body. Composing my physical body through God inside. Through God inside are in a perfect. Are in a perfect and divine balance. And divine balance. I thank you, God. I thank you, God, for keeping. Keeping me at all times. For keeping me at all times. In perfect health. In perfect health. 
God's pure light. God's, God's pure light. light shines upon every part. Shines, shines upon, upon every part, part of every atom. Of every atom within me. Within me. God's pure light. God's pure light shines upon the outermost band. Shines upon the outermost band of all atoms within me. Of all atoms within me. Vitalizing and energizing the band. Vitalizing and energizing, energizing the band. band to perfect spin and balance. To perfect spin and balance. Thank you, God. Thank you, God, for divine energy. For divine energy. God's pure light. God's pure light shines upon the middle ring. Shines upon the middle ring of all atoms within me. Of all atoms within me. Vitalizing and energizing the rings. Vitalizing and energizing the rings to perfect spin and balance. To perfect spin and balance. Thank you for healing. Thank, Thank you for healing. healing all inherited factors. All inherited factors. And also for the many. And also for the many. Genetic blessings of my ancestors. Genetic blessings of my ancestors. Thank you for healing. Thank you for healing. All past life karmic patterns. All past life karmic patterns. God's pure light. God's pure light shines upon the innermost band. Shines upon the innermost band of all atoms within me. Of all atoms within me, vitalizing and energizing the band. Vitalizing and energizing the band to perfect spin and balance. To perfect spin and balance. Thank you for healing. Thank you for healing. All traumatic, all traumatic occlusions, occlusions over my entire existence. Over my entire existence. God's pure intelligence. God's pure intelligence exists, exists within every core, within every core of every atom, of every atom within me. Within me. It is that intelligence. It is that intelligence which is the nothingness. Which is the nothingness that creates the somethingness. That creates the somethingness of my existence. Of my existence. Thank you. Thank you for creating the somethingness. For creating the somethingness from the nothingness. From the nothingness. Mm. <laughs> May the light of God. May the light of God. Enter and stimulate. Enter and stimulate every outer band, every outer band, middle rings, middle rings, inner band, inner band, and core within me, and core within me. May the light of God. May the light of God enter every core, enter every core of every atom within, of every atom within, igniting them in succession, igniting them in succession, transforming each atom, transforming each atom into an atomic sun, into an atomic sun, together forming, together forming the universal light of God, the universal light of God within me, within me. Thank you for shining. Thank you for shining. God's pure light. God's pure light. Into all eight of my bodies. Into all eight of my bodies. Igniting them in succession. Igniting them in succession. And connecting me fully and wholly. And connecting me fully and wholly. To the divine light of creation. To the divine light of creation. Of this, of this and every other universe. And every other universe. Breathe. Tongue through your mouth. Breathe, tongue through your mouth. In through your nose, out through your mouth. That was three breaths. Now, repeat after me. I direct the light of God. I direct the light of God. One zillion. One zillion. Times one zillion. Times one zillion. Into every core. Into every core. Of every atom. Of every atom. Within me. Within me. Breathe, tongue through your mouth, three breaths. I direct the light of God. I direct, I direct the light of God. God. One septillion. One, one septillion. septillion. Times one septillion. Times, Times one septillion. septillion. Into every core. Into, Into every, every core. Of every atom. Of, of every, every atom. atom. Within me. Within, Within me. me. Breathe. I direct the light of God. I direct, I direct the light of God. God. One Google. One, one Google. Google. Times one Google. Times one Google. Into every core. Into every core. Of every atom. Of every atom. Within me. Within me. Breathe. Cool. 
So we're pulling a lot of energy. This is good. Yeah. <laughs> I direct the light of God. I, I direct, direct the light, light of God. God. One Googleplex. One Googleplex. Times one Googleplex. Times one Googleplex. Into every core. Into every core. Of every atom. Of every atom. Within me. Within me. Within me. Breathe. The breath is the pump. Igniting each atom in succession. Igniting each atom in succession. Transforming each atom. Transforming each atom. Into an atomic sun. Into an atomic sun. Together forming. Together forming. The universal light of God. The universal light of God. Within me. Within me. Breathe. In through the nose, out through the mouth. I direct the light of God. I direct the light of God. One Google Plex. One Google Plex. Times one Google Plex. Times one Google Plex. Times one Google Plex. Times one Google Plex. Into my best life. Into my best life. Breathe. I like that one. Now we're going to do into my divine testing so that you get really good at this testing, okay? Mm -hmm. And testing everything all that we're going to do. I direct the light of God. I direct the light of God. When Google Plex. When Google Plex. Times on Google Plex. Times on Google Plex. Times on Google Plex. Into my divine testing. Into my divine testing. Breathe. Now, this is the energy that you feel, the blissed out and amazing, okay. is that you're plugging into your light enlightened abilities. You see? So you have these abilities, but these abilities come from you as a light being to be able to test all that we're about to test. And what is it we're going to test? We're going to be testing things that are good for you in relationship to things that are toxic. And we're gonna get really deep here. We're gonna be talking about some really amazing, uh, earth shattering, um, <laughs> before earth technology, enlightenment, the whole planet evolving, and basically uh, saving the entire human race from extinction. I think that about sums up what we're yeah, about to explain to you. Right. So you might want to keep up and listen. Which is not based on your belief system, but we're actually asking you to test. Scientifically, Scientifically, test with us. Double, double blind. And you can test at home. Right. We're testing here. We have everything set up. And this is going to be quite naturally amazing. So we're not asking you to believe anything or to trust us or to read anything. We're asking you to test and find out for yourself. Just yeah. believe in yourself and your higher power and the testing that's going to work and serve for you, for your best life, for your health, and for everything that's going to make you stronger. Yeah. Now, I'm going to go start in the more, like normally we do the hands that you do learn at the beginning to check the organs, but see, we're doing it a bit different. We're going to check numbers of your organs because we're getting into testing. So now, the basic of testing is, everyone repeat after me, what's good for me? What's, what's good, good for me? me? Makes me stronger. Makes, makes me stronger. stronger. What's bad for me? What's, what's bad, bad for me? me? Makes me weaker. Makes me weaker. Now, when you, of course, hold it up, and we're going to go here, so hold strong, hold. And so say, I love me. I love me. And see, I love me, I love me, I, I love me. me. I now love say, me. I hate me. I hate me. And immediately, super. <laughs> you do, now, we're going to do it this way. When you bring your hands together, and when you're strong, they're smooth. When you're weak, they're sticky. So go, I love me, I love me, I love me. I love me, I love me, I love me. I love me. I love me. Really mean it. I love me. I love me. I love me, I love me, I love me. I hate me. I hate me, I hate me. You can feel how sticky they get. See, My hand stops. now there's other videos we'll go into like the thoughts and everything like that. But this seat right now, we're testing the food. So, you know, 
Sticky would be not good. That would be zero. That's not where we want to go. So that's a calibrator. I love me, I hate me. Now, we're going to also do yes, 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 no, 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 which is another calibrator. Yes, yes, yes. 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 Yes, yes, No, no, no. No, no, no. No, no, no. Now, so that no, no, no is sticky. Okay, so you may need to practice that a bit. Let's try it again. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes, yes. No, no, no. No, no, no. No, no, no. No, no, no is sticky. So sticky means that your hands are not sliding easily anymore. They're kind of sticking. Slowing down. Just just getting weaker. It's getting weaker. Just kind of like slowing down. So don't be expecting, like some people get it right away. Some people, you know, it takes a little bit of practice. Well, you have to raise your vibration. Yes. So the whole thing is, is if you're having a problem with this, just rewind the video and uh -huh. say the entire body is the light again because your energy may not be high enough. You may have missed some words. You may have just listened. So you're wondering, why can't I do it? Well, go back and say it again. And if you get a little better, then why don't you do it two or three more times? You know, or go to the website, bodiesoflight.net. You can go to doc, D R L E E dot org and, and uh, go down to the Universal Edition, do that for free, and say that a number of times. You've got to raise your vibration. You understand, you have this super weak being of light, you know, you're not going to have enough energy to do this stuff. So we're here to get you to be able to do these things. And this is going to change everything. And we want you to be able to test with us. So if yes. you have to go back and say bodies of light again, yeah, two, three, three times, four times is actually optimal. Yeah. We'll be right here waiting for yeah, you. So you just go back and then come back to where the same spot where we are right now. <laughs> now. Now that you've done it and you're supercharged <laughs> and now you're like going, oh my gosh, Dr. Lee, I feel... High as a kite, <laughs> and tingly, and oh my goodness, then that's what we're wanting you to feel. Then yeah. you're ready to do it. Okay? <laughs> so now we're going to do our little small one, and it's going to be right here. And so the small one is going to be our little energy violin. Okay? <laughs> so in our energy violin, and make sure there's only 10 to 9, 10 to 9, 10 Okay, have both of you done Bodies of Light already? Good? Excellent. So now, our energy violin. Okay. And so our energy violin, and this is very powerful. You guys are going to love it. And you're going to go, now go, yes, yes, yes. We're doing great, you guys. So, yes, yes, yes. 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 No, no, no. No, no, no. No, no, no. That stickiness. See, when it gets sticky, Right? That stickiness is what? It, something makes you weaker. It's weak. Right. Yeah, okay. So this is our calibrator. It's just small. See, it's a little small version of this. You're rubbing your fingers. I hope you can see it. Yes, yes, yes. 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 No, no, no. No, no, no. No, no, no. Everyone here, everyone at home be doing it, right? And whatever is comfortable for you, it could be this thumb and this finger, it could be this finger and this thumb. Could be the other hand. Whatever will move smoothly for you. Now, what we're going to go into is we're going to take our little energy violin and go right into our organs. We're going to start with heart. Okay, so all of us go to our heart. Put our finger on our heart. That's the heart shot. Okay, so you're going to go right over the middle. You're going to come down. It's kind of between your nip, a little bit, a little above your nipple, but right here in the middle here. You go right in the middle of your sternum and start counting. So we want to see where everyone's heart's at. So go, now we're going to use the negative Google, and then we're going to go 0, 1, 2, 3, 9, 10. And usually it's right around there, but let's all check our own. Negative Google, 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Mine's a 10. What's yours at? 1, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13? 13. 13. And then what, so here's 13, which means anything over a 10 means it's healing. What's yours at? So she's like doing really good for her yeah, heart. 11. We're 11. Yeah. So yeah, so they're, they're healing. Mine's 10 neutral. So when you do healing things for your body, it makes you healthier. Now, those people who have that as being low, um, then the heart is weak. So let's say it's 0, 1, 2. Okay. If it's a 2, that would be 80% low, which we really wouldn't want that to be the case. That would indicate that you've had a very toxic lifestyle and that there's imbalances, you need to be doing bodies of light, and you need to be learning what we're doing here, which is your foods. So let's go into possibly some of the foods they may want to be careful of if their heart chi is low. What would you say? And I know one that I'm going to say in Spanish, <laughs> chi... <laughs> Chicharron? 
<laughs> pork, right? <laughs> so you gotta be really careful when that heart chi is low, right? And you're eating a lot of pork or bacon or any of those fats that are solid at room temperature. How toxic do you think that might be? Mm, it's gonna be pretty, pretty bad. Basically, it just it just weakens your heart and 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 just makes you weaker. It makes you more tired. The thing is, the heart is the most important organ in your. I mean, you gotta. It's a pump. Sure. You can't. You can't yeah, you're it's only as strong as your weakest link, right? Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. So, and I want someone to go get that heart miracle supplement because we're gonna be testing that. And so, it's in the refrigerator. And so, the thing is, is that the heart. Of course, is right here, and you can test it. And we'll go negative Google zero nine ten. Mine's a ten. If it's a two or a three, you you shouldn't be eating those fats that are solid at room temperature. Now I'm going to bring up something at that's the very least. at the very least. Yeah. Now I'm going to I'm going to come up and I'm going to put something right up here, and we're going to be able to start testing. Okay, so we're going to be praying in it over here, and I'm going to show you something that is really neat. These things come, of course, from, thank you, and then over here, and actually we'll start with this. We'll start with this beautiful product right here. And now this product, and uh, come on up, and we're gonna test, we'll just look at you. So of course, we'll look at, actually, no, let me see, zero, yes. zero one. No, actually, um, do you mind, do you mind? Or not, you do or don't want? No, I don't want it. Oh, come on up then. Let me give it. So, did we ever have you on this product? No. Okay. Oh, yes, yes. Yeah, you, you've done it in the past, haven't done it lately, yes. right? Okay, so like we're going to go right here. So, we're going to have you do and put first, I'm going to just leave this out of the way because we don't want, because you can even start healing in long distance. But we'll go to the heart, right? And we'll count, right? Zero, negative Google. And I'll, I'll do it, negative Google. And you do it at home. Negative Google, zero, one, two, two, three, would you say? One, two, or three? Right, is that what you're getting? Yeah, I'm getting three. Okay, two, three. So now what that means is that it's at 30%, and then we want the heart, oop, I'm gonna make sure this is here. We want the heart to be nice and strong, okay? So 30% would mean that it's not, not quite optimal, and, uh, and we would want that to be better, right? And so you already know, like what medically you've, you've known that there's a little issue on the heart you gotta be, take care of, right? Mm -hmm. Right, so we know that. So now, this is a great thing. It's so funny, there was this heart doctor I heard in Palm Beach was having all of his clients do this and the vitamin shop was selling out because it was so great, you know? And there's, there's so many, you could take like eight or 10 different supplements and it wouldn't be as powerful as this product. When I say it's a heart miracle, I would say, you know, and uh, we're t talking about these great things for you because we care about you. And of course, this is in the United States. I don't know if they have this in different parts of the, of the world, but of course you can get in touch and, and with us and we can help you long distance and go to drlee.org, drle.org, and I can work with you in person, no, anywhere in the world. We can find out what supplements are near you. But now we're gonna hold that, put that up to your chest and and, and, we'll, and we'll get this product on him and let's all count. And everyone in the room, say it with me. Negative Google. Negative Google. Zero. Zero. And what we're doing is a ring of light between the supplement and his body and seeing how much it likes it. Zero, one, nine, 10. Everyone, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 100, 1,000, 10,000, 100,000, right? 10 to 100, 10, 20, 30, 30,000. 30, so is everyone getting 30, 30,000? So this is double blind, this is scientific, this is bioenergetic, this is the next great leap for mankind. Now, oh, my little thing here. Now, the thing is this, is that we're all testing it, you should be testing it at home, and what you're testing is, you're testing to see if this, how this is for him. So you're not feeling it on you, but him. So it's a 30,000 on him. And now let's just put it to his belly, okay? Now, when it's on his belly, let's all go to his heart and, and do everyone do a laser beam through his heart and let's see what it does for him, okay? So now we're gonna go here and now let's look, negative Google, zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So what does that mean? That means that this supplement is bringing his heart into balance energetically. Now, do you think that would be helping any toxins that he might have been getting on maybe some foods with some fats or different things? So there's something in this product that is bringing his heart to attend. Now, everyone clap if you like this idea. It's exciting. It's good. So now we're gonna get rid of this. Just stay here because we're gonna check a few more things. Now. Um, yep, I want to do wine. So now I'm going to show you something really cool. Oh, well, you just hold this. We'll start with this one. This is a, 
a 2011, which is a French Cote de Rhone reserve. And of course, 2011 is the best year in, in, a, in 100 years uh, for European wine. Uh, and a lot of people don't know that, even better than 2005. And the reason we know that is because we do a lot of energy testing on wines. Now, notice that when we come back and we check, he was on, we come back down to the heart. Let's go look. Now that we laid that out of the way, Okay, I'll put it far away so it doesn't even help them long distance. So let's look, zero, one, two, three. So heart went back to a three. So you see, once we took it off of his body, his body goes back to where it was. Now let's come back, and why don't we hold that wine? Okay, so let's see how much his body likes that wine. Negative Google, and let's all count and feel like a ring of light between him and the, and the supplement. Negative Google, zero. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, one hundred, one thousand, ten thousand, a hundred thousand, a million, a billion. So it's a million between a million and a billion. One million, two, three, four, five, ten million, one hundred million, one hundred million, two hundred million, three hundred million. So that's about a three hundred million. So how healing do you think that is for his heart? Let's bring some glasses. <laughs> we'll be drinking it later, okay? <laughs> So what's great about this is that that higher number means it's more healing. Now notice how those French, oh my goodness, they do know how to live. They eat all that pate and all that duck liver fat and all that butter. Oh my goodness, how much butter? I think they live on butter, right? And cream. And cream, oh my goodness, you know? But what's so funny is that they drink so much red wine. Now what's great is that you can test the wine. Now, I'm going to show you something else. You're going to bring another wine you're going to love. Now, this is going to teach you where, why this is so important. Because you have a wine that's good. And let me bring this one. Here's another one. We'll take, see. Oh, first of all, let me uh, uh, hold this. Let's see what it takes his heart. I forgot to do that. So he's holding that here. Now, let's go to his heart and test. And everyone go negative Google. Zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Does everyone get 13? Yes. So 13 means 130% super healing from this wine. The wine's even better than the heart miracle. Go figure, right? <laughs> <laughs> so you see how cool that is? But the thing is, it's about you learning at home. And, and also consulting us. We can work with you long distance. We can even do Skype, FaceTime, anywhere in the world. And you can take us to your wine place and get all the best wines. Because this wine... It's good now, but if you let it get too hot or overheated or mess up, you can go from a 300 million down to a zero or even a negative number. It could be killing you. So these things have to be chilled, have to be kept right. So things can be good, but then they can go rotten. If I let that out for two days outside, it would be horrible. And unfortunately, a lot of the wines are rotten. So we're going to go check some more. Now, let me uh, do I this one. I wanted yes. to say... Um, that we found a great wine one time. We were very excited. It was somewhere over a million. We were testing it. And there, there wasn't much of it up in the bin, so we asked one of the store clerks if he could find some more for us. And we knew that the two that were in the bin were good. And so he looked at us, and he reached into the bin. Yes. And he said, well, these two are here. And we're like, and ah! They dropped from a million to a zero yeah. because he was putting his energy on it. And because he was sick. I mean, I think he had like a really bad bacteria and viruses. Right. So he zapped all the life-giving life essence out of the wine. So even though a moment ago that was a good wine for yeah. all of us, it yeah. was not anymore, which is why testing gives you an inside track yeah. on what your body wants. Yeah, it's going to change your life. You understand that in order to do this, just like we're talking about the fruit, you got to be able to get the fruit that's good for you and not get the one that's going to make you sick for two weeks. Okay, so this is very powerful, okay? Now, we're going to have them hold this one. And now hold that one. And let's see how much everyone check together. We're all checking together. Do a ring between him and this. And let's go negative Google. Negative Google. Zero. Zero. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One hundred. One thousand. 10,100, sorry, 10,000 10, to 100, 10, 8, 9, 20. This is about 20,000. So his body doesn't like it as much as it does the other one. And let's see what it does to his heart. Just hold that lower, right? And let's go to the heart. Negative Google. 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, no, 6, 7, 8, 9, I think. 1, 7, 8, 9. It's about a 9. So his heart's a 9. So it brought it up a bit, but not quite as much as the other one did. Now, here's what I want you to see this. So 
Um, now, we have this one here that was good. It helped him, right? Now, notice this, and this is a great one, but this one is a bottle that we opened up uh, yesterday and drank it last night and had a little bit in the bottom, right? This is an example of something that's gone bad or you've left it out too long. So take the little bit in the bottom and put this up to them. And I'll lay this down now. It's the same wine. And now see how this one tests on them. Negative Google, zero. zero. Okay, so now the same wine, but this one was left out too long. Now, a 10,000 is zero. So now anything below a 10 is sucking energy out of your body. Do you understand the same wine? And, and that's why it's so important. You wine connoisseurs out here need to learn this. I was wanted to do a uh, bioenergetic wine index for a major uh, publication, a major uh, magazine, and it never went through, but we were talking about it because this is gonna change the world. When the wine connoisseurs know that they can test the wine and know what's good for them and bad for them, it's gonna change everything. Now, check this out. Hold this here. Now, check what this wine does to his heart. Same wine, but this one's old and not so great. Go to heart, negative Google, everyone count. Negative, negative Google, zero. This wine actually weakens his heart. Now notice, all of us are testing this together. This is bioenergetic, this is double blind, this is the next great leap for mankind. When we can do this, we're gonna do, we're gonna do amazing things, okay? So, now here's another one. I wanna do one last wine that I love, and it's an 09. And, and you may want to get this. I don't know how much we're going to have. Proximo by Marquita Rascal. And we'll check this one on him. So hold this. And everyone do a ring and get a number. Negative Google. Negative Google. Zero. Zero. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Come on, do it with me. One hundred. One thousand. Ten thousand. One hundred thousand. One million. One billion. One trillion, so billion to a trillion, so billion, so it's a billion to a trillion, getting sticky, so billion, one nine ten, so around ten billion. So now, how good do you think ten billion would be for him? Fantastic. Fantastic. We're excited, right? <laughs> <laughs> so let's bring it down. Let's see how amazing it is for your heart. Let's go to the heart. We're going to go negative. Everyone tests. Go laser through the heart. This is the whole room is checking this. You understand how important this is for mankind, doctors, wine. So everyone needs to learn this. Okay. This is going to change the world. This is going to bring heaven on earth. This is going to change everything. I can't tell you. Change everything. Okay. But we'll go in that a little later once we get through the testing. Now, heart. <laughs> Negative, uh, negative Google, zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, 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 twelve. Is that what we're getting? So eleven or twelve. You get that too on the heart? One, two, ten, eleven? Uh, get sticky at thirteen. Eleven, me. twelve, thirteen. Okay. So it's, it's better. See, you see how this wine's super amazing for him as well. So now, thank you. you just mm -hmm. point out one thing. Yes. We have not mentioned price on wine because price is irrelevant. Mm -mm. So if something is $6.99 for the bottle. Or $8.99. Or $8.99, or if something is $30.99. Or $300.99. <laughs> right. Which we see, we, we go through these things, <laughs> and we go through the wine stores, and we see $3.99, $1,050, and we're like, oh my goodness, it's rotten and deadly. And you know, all these people, they, if they knew how to test, they wouldn't be buying rotten, deadly wine right. for $1,000 or $400. So it's not the price. It, it's what it's going to do on your body, which you yeah. can test. It's it's the bioenergetics. And, and we just saw how amazing this was for your heart. Thank you so much. You're wonderful. So now we're going to continue on and we're going to be looking at other areas. And one of the next areas that I want us to look at and that we're going to look at is stomach. Okay. Stomach. So let's all look at our stomachs. Now we're, we're going to come right here and we'll check, I want us to do like a little triangle. We're gonna check the main part of the stomach and then the, the um, ileocecal and the two sides of your lower intestines, your large intestine and ileocecal. So it's like a little triangle. So right here, let's all test our stomach and count. Now, negative Google, and you do this at home, zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I'm a nine, what are you? Seven, I think. She's a seven, so um, what are you? Ten. Ten? Ten. Okay, now, we're gonna come the intestines, so we come down the right lower quadrant, okay, of your abdomen, we're gonna test this, this is like ileocecal every area. We're gonna go negative Google, zero, one, zero, two, three, four, five, six, seven, six, I'm a six, seven on ileocecal. 
Yeah, so that's intestinals. That's like the, b the between the large and small intestine. Oh, wow. Yeah. <laughs> now, we're, we're going to be testing other stuff on these. Now, here's large intestine, which is the left lower area. It's like a little triangle. And negative Google. Negative Google. Zero, one, two, zero, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I'm a ten on that. Ten, ten, ten. Are you a three? Three? Ten. Okay. Wow. So now. So imagine um, if you can count and know exactly what organ needs healing. Yeah. And, and see, the thing is, is that this is, this is going to change the world. And, it, and when, when we talk about changing the food, one of the, I can't, I'm trying to remember the quote of one of the presidents, but when you have good food, you have a much healthier country. You, it, it helps your security. To have bad food in a country, um, it, it's destroying the population. And also it's changing our genetics. It's lowering everything. But we're going to go into that later. So now, um, anyone have some low stuff in there? Anyone have low stuff? Yes, no? Did your ears a little low? Come on up. So now we're going to come back over here. Okay. Great. Now what? Now we had stomach, and so we're going to come here. Now the stomach area. Now your stomach, and let's all do it together. So right here. Okay, negative Google. Negative Google. Zero, one, two, three, four, five, six. So now, so her stomach is a six, that means 60%. So it's about 40% off. Now, let's look at some things that are really great. And one of the areas that's a great product is Nutricology Pro Greens. Now, uh, the great thing is that you can get that usually at uh, vitacost.com has a great one. They used to have that at Vitamin Shop, but they stopped carrying it. They actually had another company that we used to recommend a lot, and they changed the formulation, and I actually even called the company, and it went from super healing to deadly. Um, but and we need, we actually would love Vitamin Shop to carry it because we have hundreds and hundreds of people who do it. Now, so let's do this, and now let's have her hold this up to her body, and let's count everyone between this product and her, and let's all do a ring of light around it and count together. Negative Google Plex, Negative Plex. zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, one hundred, one thousand, ten thousand, ten, ten to one hundred, ten, eight, nine, twenty. So it's about twenty thousand, ten, twenty. So that's twenty thousand. You understand? Anything over a ten is good, and I like to get supplements over a thousand. But a twenty thousand is downright awesome. Now I'm going to tell you that there's a lot of products that aren't that high. Okay, and we can help you uh, get in touch with me at uh, drlee.org and I can help you long distance all around the world. We have other people, uh, we have uh, Vitali, Cynthia, and many other people that are, that are literally certified with uh, Bodies of Light Healing. And what we're doing with Bodies of Light Healing is healing the being of light, which then allows your body to heal, because it's really the being of light that heals it. Now, now let's look at, when she holds that here, keep holding it here, and now let's come back to the stomach, and now check her stomach. Negative Google. Negative Google, zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, eleven, twelve, right? So eleven, twelve, eleven to twelve. So that means 110% healing on the stomach immediately by putting the pro greens on her body. Now you can do this at home. You can help your children. You can help your grandparents. You can help your dog. You can help your cats. You can help your horses. I have a lot of people that have learned to do this with their horses and had major thoroughbred horses having amazing healings because people learned the, the bodies of light system with chia food and it changed their life. You know, this is the greatest leap for mankind. This is, it's time for us to evolve, okay? So now that's a great product for her, right? So this would be great. Now let's look and let's look at some other stuff that might be good for her. And here's another one. And this is a Spirulina Pacifica, pure Hawaiian. They have that at Vitamin Shop, great product. Um, certain people do really great on that. And let's see how it does with you, okay? So hold that up to you. And now everyone in the room, be part of this, okay? Now put in, for those of you a little further, you're putting a laser. You understand, you're an infinite being of light. You at home, you in the room, can put a laser and put a ring between this and her and feel the energy of how this is on her. You know, you may be actually doing it for you, but check it on her. Feel the energy between, you're using your light, lightened abilities. You're an infinite being of light. So ring of light, let's count. Negative Google. Negative Google. Zero. Do you feel the sticky? Mm -hmm. Then zero, zero. So now, we got to see, is this a zero or is it something really bad in it that would actively kill her? So we're going to say, how low is it? How low is it? And go one, one. Zero, zero, zero. Stick you again. So that's a zero. Now, if it was a negative number, 
Let's say it was a negative 10. So you put a food up a negative 10, that would be actively killing you. That would be stuff like botulism, E. coli, food poisoning, preservatives, toxins, genetically altered crap that is gonna destroy your body. Um, all sorts of things that will lower your vibration, hurt you and make you sick. Now, you're an infinite being of light that knows and feels the energy. The only way you're able to feel this energy is when you're doing bodies of light every day, at least a few times a day, charging yourself up. And you know, and I can tell just getting this near her that it's not good. <laughs> now, now, let's look at me on the other hand. Now, on my body, Let's look and I'll count, okay? Negative Google, Negative Google. Zero. zero. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, ten, eleven. So this is ten, eleven. What that means is it's neutral. So I don't really have a problem, right? But it's, it's not gonna hurt me, not gonna help. So it's just that I don't need to have this right now, but um, it's not a bad product for me. Maybe later if I have an upset stomach or something, it might test better. But now her, her body doesn't like it all. So we're coming back, hold it on. She doesn't even want it. She's like, ah! Now she's supercharged. She's like, oh my goodness, I don't want to touch it. Now, hold it on you. Now we're gonna come down to her stomach and see how much her stomach likes it. You ready? Down here, negative Google, zero. Now, if she actually takes that product, you understand what's going to happen. It's going to upset her stomach and actually lower the vibration of her stomach chi. Now, how wild is that? You know, how many supplements do you think that you're buying and spending thousands of dollars on that are destroying and wreaking havoc on your system? I'm going to tell you, it's way more than you ever imagined. Mm -hmm. And it's... Uh, 90s percentile of, I, I can't tell you how high it is, but I can almost guarantee you, you get in touch with this, the majority of what you're taking is wrong for you because you do not know how to do the energy testing, the buys of light, and you, you don't know how to do this yet. But, as everyone here will tell you, how easy is it to learn? Easy. Yes, you can <laughs> learn it, and we will teach you, and it's gonna change your life forever. Now, let's come over here, and now, let's check another thing. Now, this is an enzyme called Megazyme by Enzymatic uh, Therapy. Um, that's a great product. And let's see how her body likes this enzyme. Okay. So now, put that up. Now, you understand that something that could be, I'm not gonna go in there, but just let's just all check it. Do a ring of light, let's check it. Negative Google. Negative Google. Zero, one, negative zero, one. one. Zero, one. Uh, yeah. What is it? What do you get? You tell, get, tell Yeah, negative. I got a zero, one. One, zero, one. So what's that mean? If it's a one, what, what percent bad is that for her? 90%. Because a one is 90% bad. A zero is 100% bad. Do you understand? Let's go to her stomach. Come down here. Everyone put a laser. Negative Google, zero. Now go how low is it? And go one, zero, negative one, negative two. This will wreak havoc and destroy her body. <laughs> <laughs> she couldn't get rid of it quick enough. <laughs> right? So you understand that it, and things can be good for one person, but not so. Now, this is one that I, that's mine. <laughs> and so I love it. But let's see how my body likes it. You ready? So she's st stepping away. <laughs> Notice how hilarious it is. So I'm going to put it up. Now, you guys check this on me, okay? Negative Google. Zero. Zero. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, twenty, thirty. Ten, twenty, thirty. So thirty. So I, it's, it's a little bit okay for me. Anything over ten is good. So this I could do. And then I can check how many do I need. Zero, one. It's not much right now. How many a day? Zero, one, two. So you can check one, two, one. And we'll teach you the numbering system as well. I don't know, it's not, we're not gonna go into numbering on this because this is more talking about toxins and the toxic environment, but you'll see another one that will be marked chia food and it'll be more on numbering and, and going into that as well and how much you eat. Now, just to tell you, so if you're taking a product and it tests a thousand, or let's say you're drinking a wine, okay? And actually I'm gonna show you this right now. Now, let's say I'm drinking this wine, okay? And you can sit down. And the first glass of wine, right? is on me, and everyone check on me. Negative Google. Negative Google, zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, one hundred, one thousand, ten thousand, a hundred thousand, million, billion, million, one, nine, ten, ten, one, hundred, about ten, twenty, thirty billion, thirty million, right? Million. Thirty million. So this is a thirty million on me. Now, as you drink it, okay, thirty million is fantastic. Why do you think I love it? Okay, and we drank it last night? Okay, so now, 
It's fantastic. My body loves this wine. I drink one, one glass, about 30 million. Now let's see, what's the second glass? On so my second glass, we can even ask, what's the second glass going to test on me? You understand, you're an infinite being of light. They've looked for this for thousands of years. You've been looking for thousands of years for this. Have a light party. Bring all your friends and teach them this. You may save your friend's life. Is that true? Yes. Yeah. Have a light party. Okay, now, my second glass. What might what the second glass be on me? Zero, negative Google, zero, one, nine, ten, ten, twenty, nine, hundred, one, two, nine, thousand, one, thousand, two, thousand. Right? Yes. So it comes down. As you drink it, it comes down. What's the third glass? Negative Google, zero, one, nine, ten, ten, twenty, thirty. Well, how, how big are the glasses you come with? Well, I'm thinking our, our glasses. We drink big glasses, okay? You know, he knows what type of glasses we drink. We're like, good, 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 we're like, okay. But that, that's my glass, okay? What's the fourth glass? You know, maybe it was zero, one, nine, one, two, three. So, okay, once it goes below a 10, you've had enough. Okay? <laughs> so let's do that on her so because things, it's fun. Okay, we're going to do that on her, okay? It's unfair, but it's very fun. Okay, so now, now, right. what's the first, now, let's test it on her, do a ring, negative, good. this lets you know how much, this helps with obesity, um, we're not going to go into obesity now, we're going more toxins, we'll talk about fat loss, and we'll be like, you know, the big fat, big fat lies revealed will be another video you're going to see at some point, but right now, and this will help you lose fat, I'm going to keep that secret for later, but right now for her, what is this for her now? Negative Google. Negative Google. Zero, zero, one, two, one, two three, four, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, one hundred, one thousand, ten thousand, one nine, ten, 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 twenty, ten, eight, nine, twenty. It's about twenty thousand. The first glass. Now, no, 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 no. What's the first quarter glass? <laughs> it's about. Now you know why they let me. It's about. <laughs> it's about like twenty thousand. Okay, okay. Let's do half glass. That's the first okay. half glass. Okay. What's the second half glass? Name was zero one. <laughs> She's a lightweight. <laughs> so you see how we're all different. And anything that's below a 10 starts becoming toxic. Now, that's scary. Why? Because the majority of stuff out there for you to eat is going to be below a 10. I'm thinking of a grocery store right now. And this is where you get on where should you shop. Okay? And I'm thinking of a grocery store right now <coughs> that I'm coughing on. And the cough, whenever you think of something, you understand you're an infinite being of light. I'm thinking of a grocery store. And my stomach starts hurting. I start feeling bad because I'm very powerful. And I'm, you're actually doing astral travel and feeling the grocery store. It's a piece of you going over there. I'm thinking of this grocery store. Everyone feel my energy. Now, what number is this grocery store on me? And I'm thinking about going to buy my groceries, okay? Negative Google, okay, zero immediately. Now, how low is it? One, zero, negative one, negative two, negative three, negative four. <coughs> negative four, there's stuff that that grocery store actively killing, would kill me. Actively killing me. So, some grocery stores you're just not meant to go to. And you, you're gonna learn to feel that energy. We'll talk about more of that in the river, which will be a future video. And, but right now, we're feeling the grocery store. Right? I'm thinking of another grocery store, and actually it's the same brand and same chain of grocery stores. <laughs> oh, the same chain. I'm thinking of the same chain of grocery stores. I want all of you to feel my energy. I'm thinking of this chain, and I love to shop there. Negative Google, zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, one hundred, one thousand, one hundred, two hundred. It's about a hundred. Ten to nine hundred, right? Does everyone get a hundred on this one? Yes. Yeah. So a hundred is above a ten. So there's actually stuff there. Okay? You understand that we're all feeling the same energy. You are an infinite being of light. We are rehabilitating you. Because we love you. And we're other light buddies and friends that want to bring you along to have fun with us. Okay? Now, what percent, of course, that one that's a negative number is 100%. I can't buy anything there. How many items, different items at this grocery store that I'm thinking of that's the same chain? 
Can I buy at? Can I buy? So I'm thinking of the grocery store. How many different items are there that are, that are good for me, that are above a 10, that it would be good for me to buy? Negative Google, zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Are we getting six, seven? Yeah, six. Are you getting six or seven? You guys testing for me? Yes. You see this is double blind. We're all plugging into infinite intelligence. This infinite intelligence comes through you. This is the next great leap for mankind. This is distinguishing and discernment and raising our intellect beyond what anyone thought a human could be. And the reason being is because you're not human. You're an infinite being of light that happens to be residing in a human vessel, right? And casing, as she loves to call it, right? And, and, and what I'm trying to get on toxins that you're starting to see on this is that some stuff, it could be the same type brand of store, but you go one store here and one store there is bad for you. One of those stores is a negative four. Everything is bad. Why is it bad? Could be the toxins, the build, it's a fairly new store, building materials and all this stuff's on the food and it got messed up and then you're going to eat there and be sick. Or people that work there. Right. Yeah, or you could have super, super sick people that are working there. Okay? So we have more stuff. Okay? So now, come on this way. So... I think you guys are starting to get blown away, aren't you? But we're just getting started. I like to think okay. of uh, all of this testing as sort of maybe as important as the discovery of fire. Yeah. And maybe you remember what a change that <laughs> You had remember on your what life. Well, of course if you were here because of course <laughs> some of us weren't here for fire. We were on other planets. Right. It's learning true. before earth technology. I was here for fire. I loved it. Were you for, yeah, yeah. It kept me warm. I was with before <laughs> earth technology because the thing is, is that we, we had much more cool things, you know. <laughs> but right now, let's keep going. So we did stomach, we did heart. Let's look at a couple other areas, okay? Let's look at liver. Oh, liver. Mm, liver. So liver, of course, is you take your right nipple, come down a little bit. And let's all test our liver. Come down about uh, two and a half, three inches. And let's count. Negative Google. Zero, one, two, three, four, four. One, two, three, four, five. Am I a three? I'm a three. One, two, three. Yeah, I'm one, two, three, four. <laughs> okay, you caught me. <laughs> Maybe I've been drinking a little too much. <laughs> or eating some naughtiness. Okay. Something like, you know. But, okay. So, or, no, actually, I think, I think actually my liver, I think this is from... Uh, Probably the gem or absorbing stuff from other people. So now, let's, uh, uh, someone else, anyone have low livers other than me? Anyone? Yeah? Are you, you okay with getting filmed? Okay, come on up. Okay, so we're coming back over. We're going to have fun. Come on over. We're going to have some liver fun. Hey. And so here we go. So we're coming right here. Everyone go in here and look at his liver. Okay. And let's check. Negative Google. Zero. Zero one. <laughs> That's horrible. So what? <laughs> of course, we're gonna. I, I got to do this because we have fun. Now, remember, this is the liver point. Is that like a little tender? Yeah. How bad is that? That's painful, right? It hurts. That's yeah. liver goes into the right hand, right in this part. You learned that on another video, but I had I had to have some fun with them. <laughs> okay. So now the liver is ninety percent low energetically, clogged up. That's not so optimal. Okay. So let's check and see um, what things might be good for your liver. And come on over. And um, let's come back to this beautiful thing called progreens, which is very cleansing, does a lot of cleansing for the body from Nutricology. So let's put that up to his body, hold it, and let's all count. Everyone count together. Negative Google, 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 100, 1,000, 10,000, 100,000, 10, 8, 9, 20, about 10, 20, 20, 10 to 20,000. Those at home, you're putting a ring around him, you're testing this through your enlightened abilities. Now, so that's super great. Now, let's hold that here, or right there, well, let's put a little R there. Now, let's come back to his liver, okay? Now, come right back to liver, come here where they can see it on the camera too. And then right here and go negative Google, Zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, six, seven, one, two, five, six, seven. Are you getting seven at home? One, seven, eight, one, two, seven, seven, eight, nine. One, two, three, four, five, seven, eight, nine. Around nine. Okay, so that's like a lot. That's a lot better. 
Is what did you get? What did you get? Well, for your. To be honest, I, I haven't gotten that. Um, Test your own liver. Okay. okay. Put your hand over it and count. Go negative Google. This is negative easy. Google. Zero. Zero. One, two, three, One, two, four, three five, four, five, six, five, seven, six, eight, seven, eight, eight, and nine. Seven, eight, eight, seven, eight, nine. Somewhere in there. Yes, sir. It got sticky. Yeah. Okay. See how easy that is. Good. You can yes, learn this at home. <laughs> okay. <laughs> It's not rocket science. You know, sure. well, it, it actually, it, it's not rocket science, but I'll tell you, it's the next great leap for mankind. Huh. Imagine if millions upon millions of people could test the food products and things all around the planet, wow. or billions of people. Did you know that everything that's been created is there because of what people are willing to buy? Now, if... The people who create the products spent more money on the product and less money on the packaging and advertising. You might actually have something to eat. <laughs> right? And so if they just said, wow, we just got to create a product that's going to heal your liver, make you healthy and happy. That is the next great leap for mankind. I can't tell you how important testing is. I mean, it's the difference between that next great leap, that new age of mankind where we have love and peace and bliss and everyone coming together, it's that or, or a radioactive, totally destructive place humans can't exist. And it's really honestly that real. Um, thank you. Thank you. And so, uh, and on that note, we're going to talk about Hi. radiation. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so all of us, all of us in here, let's all go to our thyroids. The thyroids tend to absorb a, a lot of radiation. If you've been uh, eating a lot of uh, seafood out of the Pacific, Fukushima, the radiation disaster, has been toxifying a lot of that food. They've shown that some of those fishes are coming out a thousand, ten thousand times, the radioactive dose. And of course, radiation, the body don't like so much. I'm going to check Matt. Let's all check it at home. Negative Google. You just come put your hands right here, both sides, not in the middle, both sides of the throat, right in the middle. Negative Google. Zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I'm a seven. Yeah. 70%. <coughs> okay. So now, do we have anyone that's low? How low are you? You're a three. Anyone lower than a three? You're one. You're a one. What is the telling? I'm seven. Seven, I'm seven. You're fairly low too, aren't you? Huh. What are you? Chase is three. Two, three. Two. Okay, so is it one like ten? How about Cheryl? Cheryl's two. <laughs> <laughs> two. Nigga is it one, two, about two. But she's doing nine, nine. Let's see, someone, um, is it one? You want to come back up? No? Yes? Yeah, come on up. Okay, zoom so one, two. So you're about a zoom. What are, what, everyone check his. Come on. Okay, so now we're going to come here. You, you're looking at this area on both sides of the throat. And we're going to go negative Google, zero, one, one. Okay, so he's a one. So that means the thyroid's really low. A lot of people, he's a young guy. So young guys, you know, he don't really have a thyroid problem. He has a thyroid problem because the radiation goes to the thyroid, lowers the thyroid chi um, when, because of the amount of radiation in the environment. Now, let's put this up to his neck. So put that up to your neck. And now let's check this towards that in the neck. And it's all chest together. We're all, this is double blind. Negative Google, 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 100, 1,000, 10,000, 100,000, 100,000. So you think that's healing for him? Super healing. Super healing. Okay, and I'm going to check. How many does he need? Zero, one, two, like two dropperfuls a day. But now, we're going to put this up to his body. Now, just a little lower so we can just test the neck, head back. So now let's check here and see what this does to his thyroid in real time. The iodine healing because it helps to pull out the radiation, you see. This is a great one. Vitality works. Um, liquid iodines are better. Some kelp uh, from the Atlantic. Watch out for the kelp from the Pacific. As I said, the Pacific tends to be quite a bit more toxic. Now, we're going to go here, negative Google, zero, one, two, three, four, one, two, zero, one, two, three. So it brought it up to a three. Please. Yes? Interestingly enough, check his liver now with that thing up. Um, hold it. So let's deliver it. Negative plague, zero, one, two, three, four, four. Okay, so let's come here and let's actually, you know, do a little more. Let's put it in his mouth. Open your mouth. Let's do it again. Let's do another one. 
Doop. Let's do another one. Doop. Swallow. Okay. So here, great product. So now let's come back. Come back to your throat. Go. Okay. So let's go negative. Let's check him. Negative Google. Zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight, nine. So 80 to 90 percent from the one. Thank you. On the spot. Yes. Thank you. Yes. So you understand you're an infinite being of light. And you can feel these energies. And this is your birthright as a being of light. To be able to test this, this is you. You feel this energy. Do bodies of light, start testing. We're gonna go, I wanna get real for a little bit. Um, actually, even before I get real on the radiation, I'm gonna bring up a few things. Um, you guys, here's, when you have a cold, this tends to test higher. Emergency, this is 1,000 milligrams. I'm going to test it really quick on me. You can do it at home. Negative Google. 0, 9, 10, 10, 20, 30, 30 on me. Okay. Okay. This just means I don't have a cold, but if I had a cold, it could go up to a million. You see? So right now I might do one packet. If I had a cold, I might do 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 packets. Okay. So you can learn to test this stuff and we can help you. Uh, DRLEE.org and I'm happy to help you all around the world. Get in touch with me. We're going to have fun. Okay. Now, this is... Uh, Coral Complex from Coral LLC. You can get it over at Vitamin Shop. This product on me, Nega Gooplex, 10,000. Do you think that's a good calcium? Yes. Yes. There's many, many, many calciums that are deadly. So, Coral Complex, Coral LLC. They have this over at Vitamin Shop and Vitacost.com, by the way. Now, we're going to go, niacins tend to be good when we want to have the one-two punch for radiation, you do the iodine every day and maybe the niacin once a week. Okay, and the niacin makes you turn red. And so let's check the niacin on me, negative Google, 0, 1, 9, 10, 10, 20, 10, 20, 30. So it's a 30, just because I don't really have a problem, I take this already and it's good. So, you know, when I need it, it'll test higher. If you, your thyroid's really low or you're very radioactive, you'll need more of it. Now, I'm gonna bring just a few more things. Uh, turmeric, this is a great product for your heart. It's great for your circulation. It's great for your body. I recommend finding a turmeric, a spice that you can use. They put it in the pills and usually once they're in the pills, they are rotten or not so, so good. So this on me, negative Google, 0, 9, 10, 10, 20, 100, it's 100. So it's beneficial, okay? She likes it. I put it in eggs, take the egg whites, they make it look like they take it, you take the eggs and it makes it look like real eggs. So my, check it on her. Negative head. Google, 0, 9, 10, 10, 9, 100, 1, 9, 1,000, 1,000. So it's 1,000 on her and you at home can test this on her as well. Okay, now you see this is double blind. This is scientific. This is the next great leap for mankind. Am I right? <laughs> yes. 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 And we need help. We need like 5 million bucks to get this out, to get the video to show people how to test to show people this, to do the film, to do the TV series, the Buys the Light TV series, where it's like a, uh, the fun thing with the TV series is it's gonna be like a, uh, um, uh, uh, um, what's a reality, a reality show, where you actually see us doing all this all day long with different things, and then, and it's gonna help teach mankind fast, okay? They, people love to watch TV. You know, you're watching us right now, right? Okay, so now, um, brown rice, of course, I think a lot of you guys know brown rice tends to be better. This is a Nature's Earthly Choice Basmati brown rice. Negative Google, 0, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. It's a 13. It's over 10, it's edible. Um, foods tend to be, as long as it's over 10, it's good. So that's brown rice. And I want to bring up just a few things, a couple things really quick. Uh, oats, oatmeal. There were some cereals that had oats in it that were really good that we used to recommend a lot, but unfortunately, a lot of those cereals have been putting um, byproducts in it, so hardly any box of cereal with oats in it is edible anymore. But good old fashioned, just generic oatmeal. Let's check, negative Google, 0, 9, 10, 10, 20, 1, 2, 3, 23. So it's over 10, it's good, okay? When it's under 10, it's not, okay? If it was a two, they'd be 80% bad. Now, we're gonna come over here, and this is actually, I'm proud of this company, uh, General Mills, uh, Simply Nutritious Rice Checks. We want to recommend and be happy with the ones that are actually being good. Negative Google, zero, one, two, nine, 10, 11, 12, 12. So this is edible. This is something you can actually eat and uh, put in your body. 
course it is gluten free now I do want to bring up gluten free now why is it that the entire United States is having gluten intolerance why do you think that is <laughs> okay do tell I think we want to hear why the entire United States oh, grab see, a seat let's see. all get here why, why do you think the entire United States is this wheat belly this gluten intolerance why why oh why well, basically, I, I experienced it on my own as I was working at a restaurant some time ago, and I've seen that, that a lot of people are actually eating a lot of, uh, let's say, pasta was made here, pizza, the, the dough was made here, and, and all these weeds actually are changed. They're not as weeds that they used to be before, even though uh, a lot of European weeds are still good, they're not modified, they're it's not changed. From Italy? Yeah, for Italian. And yeah, so why is it that <laughs> American, why, what is it about all of our American wheat that isn't seem to be working so great? Isn't it genetically modified? Yeah, but you know, it's not that it's just genetically modified, it's how they modified it. Does any, anyone know? Oh. Do you know what they did? Do you know at home <laughs> oh. exactly how they modified And you the need weeds? to know this. Well, I'm going to tell you, and of course, um, let me see if I can say this. I, they don't want you to know because Maine, I think, had a, a GMO law to label the wheat. And then um, a nice little company uh, sued them because they didn't want it to be labeled. Now, why do you think they don't want to label the wheat as genetically modified? Because you probably stop eating it. Yeah, because they don't want you to know how bad it is. Now, you understand that when you know how to test, this is going to change everything. Now, the reason it's going to change everything is because you're not going to be able to be tricked. It's very interesting that we live in a society where the dollar became more important than our entire civilization. Until now? You know, the thing with wheat is this, is that it's not just that they could have made it, they could have taken an ancient grain and made it easier to, to create and, and made something that really was nutritious and helped people. They could have yes. genetically modified it and checked it on the body to make sure that it was healthy and that people would be more nutritious and that it would make you smarter and more brilliant, more beautiful. But no, that wasn't the goal. The goal was to sell more toxic chemicals to the farmers. And I went over to my relative and we were going through these farms and I'm looking and looking and we were doing the testing and looking to right, looking and saw all this wheat and it was all like a negative 10, super deadly. And it's so crazy how you can see a sign that says beware of this wheat you know, walking around it, touching it, or being near it. But then they take the same thing and bring it to your table. <laughs> but you gotta understand the karma in that. The karma in that is this, is that when you're killing off your population and destroying your digestive system and giving them cancers and sicknesses, um, it's not only bad karma for your company, it's bad karma for our whole nation and the world at large. Mm -hmm. um, these, these products were, um, I'll give you an example, wheat was created in order so that a weed killer won't kill it. So if a weed killer <laughs> won't kill the wheat, okay, you know, this toxic deadly chemical that kills plants does not hurt the wheat. That's kind of a clue. Okay. Do you understand, you ever see how these junk food they put on a counter and it sits there for 10 years and it's still there? Do you think that your body could digest it? If a toxic deadly chemical, you think your enzymes and that the acid in your stomach can digest the wheat? If a toxic deadly weed killer can't break it down? No, they created a new strain of wheat that a toxic, deadly weed killer can't deconstruct. So isn't it interesting that almost everybody suddenly in the United States is gluten intolerant and that the wheat in our country makes you sick, yet many, many, many countries all over the world, over 20-something countries and scientists and people that have the medicine is paid by their country outlaw our wheat 
because the scientists know that it would make their populace sick. So what is it about the karma of our country, and I love our country, that lets the mighty dollar destroy the lives of millions of Americans and destroy the health and create gluten intolerance and problems? Because we've noticed that we're able to go get Italian wheat. We mm. love going to this place around the corner <laughs> and, and they have this Italian wheat pizza and we get this beautiful Italian wheat and it's divine, isn't it? And the body loves it. And your you stomach feels good and you know, you check your stomach point and your stomach's still high vibrational after having a wonderful pizza. I mean, isn't that what food is for, to like be enjoyed? Didn't Hippocrates say, let food be your medicine? And medicine be your food. You see, the thing is this, is that we've gotten so far away because honestly, people have lost, the, and it really started when we lost our track in the light. If you're gonna follow the light and learn to test and regain your enlightened abilities, you're gonna test your foods and only do things that are 10 plus. So you're only gonna eat food that's 10 plus. And what you're gonna learn about the path into the light is this, and especially with foods. The path into the light is full of what? Pleasure. 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 <laughs> so when you drink these wines that are high vibrational and eat these foods that feel good and take these supplements that test super high, how does it feel? Good. Oh, Pleasurable. It's Fabulous. like an orgasm. <laughs> you have a feels, healthy, it's happy like a body. Bodygasm. <laughs> Imagine feeling good all the time. Because you understand that that's a path into the light when you're eating things mm -hmm. that are non-toxic for your body. And you saw examples where one person's body was good and another person's wasn't. But see, that's where you have to test. You know, that's where you have to dig into, dig into the vegetables, even if they're organic, make sure they test good. You gotta learn to test, get in touch with this. And this is especially exciting, I think, for mothers that are providing food for their family. Yeah. Wouldn't you love to provide the right foods for all of your children? You've seen families where yeah. one child is obese and the rest are not. Yeah. That child needs a different diet. Yeah, I mean, it's so interesting how even, you know, the foods are affecting the whole world. I saw, mm -hmm. I saw um, pictures of the Queen of England and you could see where, look, you just look at the parts of the brain, the right, left brain, the brain shutting off, and, and the body shutting down. And, and when you test, it's literally the foods that, that they're, they probably think they're getting your good food, but no one's testing it. And we would love to come over and, and teach the, the royal, royal doctors how to do bioenergetic testing to help the royal family because, you, and, and, you know, it's just, I can't tell you how we notice things just seeing a picture, just seeing a film. Um, you can at home, well, you know, when, when you do bodies of light, it's kind of like taking the red pill in the matrix, you start feeling the energy of everything. Mm -hmm. But the key is this, when your energy is low, you can't feel anything because you're so low. You have to raise your vibration and do bodies of light so that you can feel the difference, so that you can start doing the energy testing. Um, I think we need to back up again and, and go back to the, the radiation and back to that and, mm -hmm. and what's kind of in store for the planet mm -hmm. if we do not learn to test. I, I really, um, we were feeling the energy we were channeling recently, right? Um, one of the, you know, world's top psychics that, uh, that we only had two years. You want to tell us about that? So um, there's a lot of radiation being dumped into the ocean right now. And as you know, ocean water is eaten by the animals, which we're eating in the sea animals, but it also evaporates and it floats through the clouds. And I remember I was flying back and I was flying through the United States. This was uh, maybe a year ago. And I remember uh, the plane came down low at one point and looking at the big fluffy clouds, there were beautiful clouds everywhere. And sitting beside me was a pilot and he was giving me the most interesting information about how they can tell the weight of clouds by the size and all this stuff. And I remember when I got back, I, I was feeling sort of drained, not a hundred percent and I love a window seat on the plane yeah. and I was telling Dr. Lee about this and we started testing and it turned out that I got radiation poisoning by sitting on the window seat of that plane as we flew through the clouds. Yeah. So this is through America a year ago. So if you think that you're not being affected by radiation, yeah. clouds become rain, it goes into the ground, yeah. we're eating these foods, 
it's time you learn testing. Yeah, it's like it's almost like um, how do you survive in a toxic environment? And it's a very toxic environment. And mm -hmm. we're finding that the uh, uh, those two supplements, and I'll bring them up again, which is the iodine, um, iodine and the, the niacin. The twin and the iodine. niacin. Mm -hmm. It almost seems because you gotta understand that not only see we we know how to test. So we're not eating the seafood that's radioactive. We're not buying the vegetables that the, the radioactive rain landed on. But I'm gonna tell you, you know what we are doing? Absorbing. We're, we're hanging around with a lot of people. You know what, yeah. we love people. Right. <laughs> so, oh, so let's talk about the cruise. Yeah, we went on a cruise and we were, we were cleansing uh, so all the radioactive fish we, for right. a week. We went on a cruise and for some reason I took niacin. Um, the iodine with me no and reason. I was my guidance was telling me to take the iodine daily and Dr. Lee did not take the iodine with him and when we got back we had both of us radiation poisoning yeah. to different degrees not from the foods that we ate mm -hmm. but from the people around us. Yeah, Radiation spreads so the thing is, is that even if you're testing and you're not eating the radioactive products all that seafood that was radioactive that everyone else was eating, mm -hmm. um, the, it was coming off of them and, and, and literally affecting uh, us. Our, our bodies were absorbing the radiation yeah, from yeah. other people. And that, that was another thing I noticed with the, uh, the I, I keep going back to the Queen of England, I noticed she had, she had more radiation. I think she's, you know, when people who are like, no, like you know, diplomats are around like, you know, thousands and thousands of people right. and, and their attention is on them, they can, that radiation can go into them. So it's about cleansing. Now, some of the best stuff we find is the liquid iodine and the niacin and you can you feel that you have that you feel low here get in touch with us drle.org um, a lot of people are getting major diseases from this radiation because the radiation gets in the body and it alters the cells and then when it's there for long enough it can create all sorts of health problems diseases and a disease is a dis-ease it's a lack of balance in the body and cancer so yeah, right so if you go to mm -hmm. a doctor and you have a complaint about an organ or they test it somehow and it's the organ that's failing but how many doctors and I pray there's a lot more now mm -hmm. know to test you for radiation poisoning yeah very few and so let's just do some chemo on top of the yeah, radiation they give you poisoning. more what they do is they, they give you more radiation and then they do x-rays <laughs> <laughs> but ultimately the thing is is that you gotta you understand that what that we're in it for the sake of the human race mm -hmm. okay so all of these toxins, all of the, you know, our, our planet isn't taking it serious on the amount of radiation being put in the Pacific. Um, if they were, if you had billions of people that could test, um, we would have already gotten things handled. We would be doing things and using before Earth technology. A lot of us who, who remember thousands of lifetimes um, remember uh, before Earth technology of, of like uh, algae and different things that on other planets the algae would eat the radiation exactly, and it would pull it. Balance. Into, yeah. So you understand there's a lot of before earth technology that as people do bodies of light, there's a lot of problems on this planet that are that as it becomes more industrialized are getting worse. And so we're either gonna take that next great leap as infinite beings of light and remember our past lives on other worlds that went through the same industrialization that this planet is going on. You understand we're at a make it or break it point. And, and now now like now we're in the next two years we were feeling that this testing has to be done in the next two years because mm -hmm. what's happening is we're going so much faster on destroying the planet that if we do not use before earth technology mm -hmm. now this before Earth technology is you doing buys of light um, hopefully get in touch with us so we can help you release these past life psychic scars quicker because mm -hmm. it takes seven years which is too long um, the, you know any other way but when you get enough people that are that are quickly and it can happen within six months or a year remembering this this before earth technology you know there's different algaes that can eat the radiation mm -hmm. there's different things what you'll find is that the hope for our planet is within a lot of and, and you know the genetic engineering isn't always a bad thing if they test it on on your body you know, make it right. And, right. and there's, there's machines on other planet that, that do bioenergetics and, and scans and test the body. Right. Like you could do, you know, these scans from before technology on other yeah. planets, mm -hmm. um, you, would, they, you would eat one piece of wheat bread and they would instantly be like, meh, 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 meh. they would know. <laughs> 
yeah. all the organs shutting down. Do you see? <laughs> and We're so was, backward um, on this planet. Huh? I was with a friend at dinner, and I noticed that every time he eats bread, his nose starts running. And so I suggested at one dinner that he not eat bread, and just to see the difference. And he had absolutely no reaction to it. So he said to me, oh, I must be wheat intolerant. Well, so then I took him to a restaurant that has Italian wheat. Yeah. And I had him eat the bread there, and he had no reaction to it. Yeah. So are you wheat intolerant? Are you gluten intolerant? Or are you American wheat intolerant? Or are you deadly food intolerant? <laughs> the thing is that you got to learn to test. This testing, we're in a two-year window. We're destroying the planet and it quicker than you can shake a stick at. Right. Um, uh, uh, things coming up from China the, in the air, coming over and then landing here. You know, our planet is, is, is really collectively getting the technology to, to communicate. And can but, we talk about the uh -huh. radiation in the cars coming over as well? Yeah, let's do it. You know, we notice also a lot of the, uh, we can't say the brand, but a lot of the cars from Japan. those air, yeah, the Japan are coming over and they're radioactive. And we see people having their thyroids go bad from the radioactive cars. But see, there's a lot of before to earth technology that those car companies could use to, to take, get rid of the radiation, not only for their citizens, mm -hmm. but off, also off of the, the electronics mm -hmm. and the cars and automobiles that they're sending to us. And of course, our country just doesn't know about that. Well, mm -hmm. it's more of, a, of on demand. Basically, they can, make it, they can make it bad stuff. They can make it good things. The thing is, yeah. if you're not asking for it, they have no need to make it something bad. It's intellect. You understand yeah. that we got to raise our combined intellect on Earth. And the thing is, nothing is going to ra raise the intellect on Earth quicker than testing. You understand, testing is going to change people overnight. But things we need to have a mass, we need to have a mass public awareness campaign uh, across across mo t over 22 languages across the planet mm -hmm. to start evolving mm -hmm. ev everything along the supply chain mm -hmm. so that from where it's being made over in India to where it gets here in the United States all across the supply chain they're creating better products mm -hmm. you see everywhere from the cotton we, we understand like there's like got compatibility like there's there's a lot of things being done but the testing is what's going to to evolve the entire planet into into creating products that evolve the planet higher you understand that all this radiation poisoning toxins chemicals that are killing and destroying people it the planets remember the before or the other planets yeah. we've been on when you're on another planet on the past slides we remember um, the ones that had the short lifespans where they were killing everyone off quickly just like our planet's getting into with all the toxins and everything um, were devolved which means that they had war, they had strife, they got worse. The planet just went to pot, right? Mm -hmm. On those. And we still basically, we either make it or break it. Yeah, either we're, we're going to evolve that. with the testing and everybody's going to wake up and start yeah. creating better things. Either we're going to go to total disaster and collapse. And, yeah. you know, there was a high possibility we're going to have a World War III within quite some time. Yeah, it's what, not 23, 24 years? In the yeah, testing? It, and it's not far if you think about it. If yeah. you're about 30 right now, or let's say, of, you know, younger, a little older, like 20 years, they go by fast. And then all of a sudden, we're going to have a World War III. Yeah, There's the thing is, is our technology is coming to the point where separate ideologies are able to communicate. So you understand that you can communicate light or dark. If you look at Nazi Germany, what did they communicate over their mass medium was hate and division, which is dark. The darkness separates us. Mm -hmm. Now, the light brings us together as one. Mm -hmm. The darkness makes you hate things, the light makes you love things. So if we don't get people to discern against even to eating light-filled products, mm -hmm. Um, what happens is that they're so sick, they can't follow the path into the light. Mm -hmm. See, if you're toxic, it's difficult to, to choose the right governments. To, to, you, know, you notice that the parts of the world going down um, that, that have horrible food and everything else, that they can't even have a stable society at all. And it's, it's going to happen to the whole planet, and it is contagious. It's, the dark energy is like a virus. We either need to help the whole planet as one with the technology and make it to where all the phones, and it doesn't have to be expensive, where people can have translations and the phones and be able to hook up all around the world into, into information, information and education and enlightenment, mm -hmm. or it's not going to be so great. And I just uh -huh. want to say one thing about testing that I personally love, because I have not got time 
to research mm -hmm. everything about everything that I want to put into my body yes. or put on my body yes. or hair products. Because this goes, we didn't even go into all the lotions and cream, makeup, testing and your, your skin, clothing. It? It's like so much. So with testing, I don't have to do any more research. I don't have to know what is the newest, latest and greatest invention. I don't have to know what company is making better products or what are they actually doing behind the scenes to create the product. I don't have to know as I mentioned earlier, what happened from the time the orange was planted as a seed and everyone that handled it until it gets to my hand yeah. from a shopping center, all I have to do is test, can I eat this orange? And, and know if it's above a 10. And it's simple. It's and yeah, simple. It's, it's, it's the next great leap for mankind. You understand that, that Maya Angelou, I love, I love her quote, that if, if you've learned something, teach it. Mm -hmm. If you have something, give it. And the thing is, this, this knowledge we know uh, we know is the greatest leap for mankind and so we're, we're, we, we're working on getting out there. Of course we need like five or ten million from those who want to make the earth evolve to get this in a broader way. We need to have a campaign, a mass awareness, we need to have bodies of light out there, we need to be teaching people how to do this. We're, we're in a timetable and we're here. We're here for those who have the funds and the wherewithal to, and we're here to teach you. Not only are we gonna help, you know, actually, I'm gonna tell you, Steve Jobs. Um, I, I, I would see when, when he was going through this um, with his pancreas and everything, I saw it was a negative number on his pancreas and I wanted to help, help him, uh, teach him how to heal himself. And I knew that he would, if he healed himself, that he would help the world be healed. Of course, I never got in touch with him, it never happened. But I'll tell you, for those of you who maybe do have an issue and would love to learn bodies of light and how to heal yourself, how to test everything and evolve and heal your family and your friends and your community, um, come get in touch with us. Mm -hmm. And those who have a lot of money, you know, it's your karma, you have the money. You can use the money to change the world and teach these basic methods that are, are your right as a light being. You're an infinite being of light that thinks you're a human because your energy is so low. Imagine it's your birthright to keep this casing, as I call it, mm -hmm. healthy. Yeah, and, and, and our planet could have so much, like amazing wines everywhere and amazing things. You understand that things, it's really not that hard to create a good product if people are able to have discernment, you see? But you understand where we're going now is devolution of our, ge of, of our genome, of our genes. Mm -hmm. um, you have a lot of people eating really horribly and they're taking all these toxic chemicals and, and literally the genetic code is devolving from the toxins. Yeah, why okay. do you think all these kids are getting born and having all of those and diseases? Mental and defects yeah. and problems. Now, yeah. the, the, pl the planets we were on where, where they didn't take care and they had short lifespans were not good. The planets that had long lifespans, and remember those? those. Definitely, the, the ones definitely. long lifespans, really long lifespans, mm -hmm. those planets evolved very high culture you see, so I know people don't necessarily want to have a long lifespan because they're worried about the population. But you gotta understand that as we create longer lifespans and as we learn to test, we're going to also learn that we shouldn't have so many children and this has to be a conscious choice. Where like you, a person learns to test, how many children should I have? One, you know. These people who have 15, 18, 20 children, you know, it may look good on a reality show. But it, it, you understand it's not sustainable and it will destroy the planet. We, we're, we're, we're having too many children and we better wake up. And, it, and, and it's not about lowering the lifespan from keeping people sick, which then devolves the whole society. We need a longer lifespan. As we have longer lifespans, a healthier, longer, healthier lifespan. longer lifespans, and we start learning to do the mm -hmm. testing and changing the products and everything, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. we're going to have a heaven on earth, okay? Mm -hmm. But right now, there's a certain, and we'll, maybe if you get in touch with us, we'll tell you the percentage, because there's a percentage that we always test. Yes. What percentage are we on the path to heaven on earth? And we're not going to tell you. You have to get in touch with us in person, okay? Because then, we want you to be healthy. Yeah, and then we test another one. What percent are we going to have have the world go into not sustainable where it's where it's unfit for human population and there's a number on that that's quite high as well but the key is we would love to teach it to you where you could test it too this is infinite knowledge this is your right as a as a being of light to be able to test this to be able to test your food um, this is something that everyone on the planet should have the right to do in the path to be able to to do right 
The, um, we, I, I want to bring in also the positive end. We have people that we know that are doing really good mm -hmm. on the healing nutrients because yes. there are healing nutrients in the United States and it does need to be legal. I'm going to say it right now <laughs> that every living thing on the planet is our right. Okay. Every herb, every natural plant is our God-given right on this planet? Natural, not processed. Yeah, we're talking about Natural. things grown that, that come in a nat that were grown and that came from the earth, evolving it over millions of years. These things should be legal. Okay, I'm gonna say I'm gonna, I'm gonna say I'm gonna get you in trouble. Marijuana should be legal, right? These things should be legal. Okay, it's grown. Okay. Cigarettes are legal. You know, I know they're really bad, you know, but they have all the toxic <laughs> chemicals they put in them. But, you know, that should be legal. Um, there's other things, and I'm going to say it, I think I say it, like things like ayahuasca, peyote, um, these, these things, you know, uh, probably mushrooms that come, evolve naturally. Um, now, I'm not saying process, and I'm going to even say things like uh, the cocaine leaves. You know, I, you understand that cocaine, if you look at a picture over in Colombia, the leaf itself, if you made a tea out of it, would be like having caffeine. You see, and it tests non-toxic. Might test a 20 or 30. But once they put all the chemicals and the, in the, uh, they put the oil and the gasoline and they burn it and all the other stuff, it becomes a negative thousand. But you understand, it's not about spending billions upon trillions, billions of dollars trying to, in a dark way, force the population a certain way. It's about evolving the nature of the consciousness of the entire world to where a person says, oh, you know, that's a negative thousand. And of course, cocaine in its current state, the way they make it should be illegal, you see. But the leaf itself, non-processed as a tea or whatever, should be legal, you know, because it's, it's, it's like caffeine. You know, but it's, 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 it's about us realizing as a society to these bioenergetics, which are huge. You understand that there's so much that has been, that's creating strife and war and suffering on this planet. Anything where there's war, suffering and strife, there's dark energy there. And the path into the light will fix it. Testing will fix it. Doing by the light will fix it. Evolving our consciousness higher will fix it. It's going to fix your health. It's going to fix our world. What? And I just want to say that whether you believe anything or a little bit of what we've said, we invite you to contact us mm. or to watch this video again and learn testing. Yes. That's watch all we want. Have a light part. It's for you to learn testing and get the answers for yourself. And bring all your friends together. Have a light party, have some wine, <laughs> maybe find those some ones we got, wine. test it, you know, <laughs> test some wine. You can, you can call us and we can do, on an ask a question, we can have you take pictures of the wine and tell you the wine that's good that's so you right. have a high vibration one Before you buy it, send us a picture. Yeah, it's only like 25 bucks, you can do that online, that's cheap, <laughs> you know. And so the thing is this, is that have fun with it. Know that the path into light is full of pleasure. Mm -hmm. Know that that you can heal yourself. Know that this is your God-given right as a being of light, that our planet is on the verge of evolving. That, I mean, you know, the Messiah they were looking at for thousands of years is you, is your inner light, is testing. That coming Messiah thing that's going to create heaven here. on earth, it's you. <laughs> it's, the, it's this, it's testing. If you know how to test, then everyone's going to start creating higher vibrational stuff and we're going to have, we're going to have heaven on earth. And, and great products and great foods and it's like, it's just beautiful. You know, we, we got to evolve. We're gonna either evolve or perish, you know, and we're excited to help you and encourage you. And, and also, uh, what other stuff do we, the before with technology, is there anything you wanna bring up on any of these or what do you remember? Well, before, before earth technologies, basically, uh, these are technologies that were a uh, long time before earth happened, before you were like born or before the history happened in, on earth. And these are technologies that actually help to evolve and help to, all of us will help. And some of the technologies are getting kind of like here and there. Through industrialized. See, we remember many lifetimes where, you know, what, someone, you were, you were, you, you, you were having, like, just having the one where, where everyone was bloody and there were like, you know, 30,000 people d killed, right? And, and it was with a spear. You know, so we have these normal, normal civilizations that were lower, but in before technology, a lot of us remember so many lifetimes where they were more higher culture. 
Mm -hmm. You see, and those higher cultured had longer lifespans, mm -hmm. and they had this great, they had free energy, which you had, they had fusion, they, you know, some of them had genetically modified stuff, but they have machines that they put it through, you know, that check to see that it was actually, you know, they would take an ancient grain and make it more viable, but not make it to where you can't digest it. Some of it's just plain greed and stupidity and destroying our entire planet and our culture and our, you know, having everything toxic for people to eat makes people less productive. Well, the right? thing is, everything comes on demand. On, on, on planet Earth, everything is made for demand. And it's made on what people want. So when, yes. when the consciousness yes. rises where, where everyone's able to test... Yeah, so mm -hmm. if you start testing, more you start testing, we've got to have an entire society testing all the foods and everything. Let's yeah. say they just test it and say, well, you know, cocaine is, is not good, like in this kind of form, so let's not have it. So what's going to happen, these guys who actually process it, who make it, it's going to, well, people don't buy it. I mean, why would we have to produce something people don't buy it? Let's make yeah. something something else that people are going to buy. And right. as, we, as we test, we're going to find those good things. And the big corporation, actually, those guys who, who make the products for us, who make the, all these groceries in the stores... They'll make was, better stuff. Yeah, they will right. start making better things because you you've got to be willing to buy it. That things could be genetically altered that could actually be beneficial. Unfortunately, in a good way. they're just not. The stuff like so far is so low. A healthy and also, potato chip. Yeah, yeah, we could have companies get in touch with us. We'll teach you how to test these genetically altered things on your body so you'll actually make things that are good. <laughs> It's like, right now, I just don't see any of them as good yet. But the thing is this, is that, you know, I also saw so something what, what? where um, they actually use potato chips as um, lighter fluid to start coals in a barbecue. Hmm. That's convenient. <laughs> Are you eating yeah. that? I want a healthy potato chip. Yeah, I mean, you know, things, and you understand that things that are above a 10, they're pleasurable. Mm -hmm. You're going to make more money. We, we, we invite you, you major multinational corporations to get in touch with us. We'll, te we'll teach you. <laughs> we'll teach your entire scientific staff. You understand, we're, we're wanting to, to evolve everyone. That you understand, the light brings us together. The light does not attack. The light envelops with love. Right. The light pulls us all together in a union. The light is going to bring the world together. You know, all you need is light and love. I mean, I feel like I'm singing that <laughs> that song. <laughs> all you what? need is love. love. <laughs> it's like, you know, it's 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 like you know. So let, let's just do this again. Like this is the motion. Yes. How hard is yes, that? Yes, yes, yes. No, no, no. You just got to do by the light <laughs> to have your vibration high enough for it to work. Because you can only test as high as you are. Okay. And also, you know, in honor of Before Earth technology, of course, we're going to do a Subscara. Hopefully, let's see someone that has some Before Earth stuff that's going to be fun. Um, let's see. Come on up. We're going we're gonna to have fun with you. I think we're going to have... <laughs> this guy is... is we're going to find out how far that is. And we're going to have a good time. Slide it. Let's see how much... Let's yeah. see. Let's see if we got any Before... I would be so happy if there's some Before Earth technology on this one. <laughs> so, this guy is let's see how far he is in to his <coughs> subscars and oh please i'm crossing my fingers please <laughs> please please and before technology that'd be like so perfect okay so because this guy's had some great stuff he's been on he this guy's been a scientist and an artist and worked on so much before technology he should write a book but Okay, so say I am willing. I am willing to open up. To open up to the psychic scar. To a psychic scar. It needs to be cleared next. It needs to be cleared next. For my best life. For my best life. Okay, so let's see that. that. So let's check how far it is. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, twenty-eight, twenty-eight hundred lifetimes. Twenty-seven, twenty-eight. Twenty-seven, twenty-eight. So he's around twenty-seven, twenty-eight hundred lifetimes ago. Millions upon millions upon millions of years ago. <laughs> So, we do not know what's about to happen, but hey, this is the fun of it, and it's a surprise. That, what's going on? That. Hmm. That. 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 Open up to now, this open up to is what's open important up to for scar. a lot of people to do. To we have psychologists doing this, they love it. That. I see like a tower. Yes, a tower. <laughs> <laughs> that, please. That. that it feels like I'm stuck. <laughs> what? Say it. I don't know. Am I, am I stuck in the tower? Like in the top of a tower? It feels like it. 
Watch your hand on there. Yes, are you stuck in the tower? Yes, it feels yes, that's, right? That's smart. Smooth, so we're checking. This is another one, you'll see how we do smooth and sticky, but we're just checking that. Uh, what's going on? Ooh, mm. what's that? Uh, I think goodness. I'm like using something in top of the tower to like attack uh, yes. things that yes. are like flying around. Yes, what is flying around? That. Like, I don't know, like. I think. Yeah. <laughs> they look like these creatures. It, 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 I, I thought they were like like something, some type of machine, but it's like creatures. They're live. They're yeah. <laughs> Long time ago. <laughs> now you know where sci-fi comes from. Okay. Yeah, they look interesting, aren't they? It's like, a, <sighs> like some sort of creatures. That. So it's like this creatures. tower is part of like a chain of tower. Yes. That protect uh, yeah. these animals from crossing to the others, to the border or something yes. like that. Yes. Yes. Yeah. It's like, it's... Mm. They look like pterodactyls or dragons. Yeah, like pterodactyls, look, like something some like that. Weird flying creatures. That. And I'm like shooting at them. Yes. I'm using this like uh, it's kind of like a laser beam or. Yeah, is it a laser? He's like super advanced border patrol. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. The, yeah. It is like a super advanced border patrol. It feels like <sighs> laser. It feels yeah. like laser. Hey, this is the before technology we're talking about here. <laughs> we need this. Okay, keep going. And. Um, Ten percent. <sighs> That, that. It's weird, it's almost as like, did, did one of these animals that. like, got inside the tower somehow? Yes, it did something like messing up the tower. That. It, it feels like I'm trying to it's communicate to someone else. Yeah. And they're yes. not responding. Yeah, yes. they're doing something to the tower, that. And I'm like, scared, cause these things are scary. Yes, yes. very scary. They seem they're like, very carnivorous. They, they love to- Like four times the size of a car. They're, they're, they seem huge. Well, it's like- How did, how did it get inside the tower? It's so big. I don't know. That. that. <coughs> did that it like broke scary. through? Yeah. I, think, I think it just broke through like the side of the tower inside into it, like something. Yeah, yeah. oh yeah, because that's in, the, in the beginning of the subscriber, that, that's what I was seeing. I was yeah. seeing like an explosion, like in the under, like underneath, and I was like in top of the tower. Yeah, that's what yeah. I was feeling. Something like something like shook the tower, and I was yes. on the top. Yeah, I didn't know how to explain it, but now I understand. Yes, mm -hmm. oh, that. Mm. that, that. So I am not able to shoot at them right now, right? I'm not able to defend. This, p this outpost or something, I'm not able to defend it. He's doing great. And yeah. I'm afraid that they can destroy it. Yeah, hmm. uh-oh. They're big enough, they, they can yeah. like... That. Yeah, apparently that laser thing isn't working. <laughs> what do they do? That. Do, do they... Does it eat you? <laughs> that. I don't know if it eats What's me. What's it do, say it. I just, that. I'm just like at the top of this room in the tower and I see them kind of like flying around. Yes. yes. And. That. I feel the tower just shocking. Like yes, something underneath in the in the in the like in the lower base of the tower got there was like an explosion. I mean they did they did something that that it even enabled the laser beam from being able to work. Yes. yes. So, but I, and then I just keep feeling the tower like sh like so. like moving. Like yes. I feel like it's gonna crumble at some point. Yeah. It's smooth when he says the truth. Yeah, so, so you know he's saying the testing. truth. You have your own lie detector. We'll do yeah. another video talking about lie, truth, and lies. But, you know, oh. that. I'm like scared. That. I am that. scared, scared, that. scared, that. scared. I'm trying to figure out a way to escape, but, I mean, that. I, I just don't know how to, how to get out of here. That. Right now. Um, that. It feels like I, I, I walked to the outer uh, part of the tower. That. Like I'm, I'm in the upper level and I walk through like a balcony or something on the tower. And yeah. I'm trying to, I think there's like an outside like ladder yeah. in the south tower and I'm trying to like escape through that ladder. Uh -huh. Because the inner, there's like an inner elevator or something that's not working. Uh -huh. yeah. So I have to like now try to escape the tower to like the outside and I'm really yes. hoping these animals don't see me going out. Yes. <laughs> and that's exactly what did not happen. Yeah. <laughs> 82 percent because he you just like he just snatched me from the ladder and like yes yeah. <laughs> that what say it that it's that what's it like at its worst oh, that it's, say it's, it it's like a, it's like a cracker yeah oh my like, uh, <laughs> <it's> like crunchy <laughs> no i think like one like took me uh-huh 
and like ah. just like just hold me, hold me like the thing, and then like another one came and, and like just ripped me yeah, apart. Like, yeah, he's like in half. Uh, it feels painful. Oh my goodness, that's uh, that, oh, it, it. Just it's fun. It's like a, it's like a watching uh, movie. It is funny. It is like watching. Movie. <laughs> it's like what was fighting like just took took half of me from the from the like one had Woo! like one was holding it's me. Guts in, everywhere. I I see little pieces of intestine falling down. Yeah, well. it's like this one snatched me and he was holding me yeah. in its thing and then Spaghetti. the other one just came in and, and, and ripped me apart from him yeah. oh my so how do you feel uh, I have Nine. like my upper part of the body now with this other one and I'm still kind of like alive and I'm like super Barely. suffering and then the yeah. other one is holding my legs and he's I'm like, like, like totally in shock or something yeah, and totally I, I am in total shock I'm in total like and I'm still alive I don't know like, I, my, like the part a little bit like the part of my head is actually kind of like like I'm actually like that, that my brain is functioning pretty interestingly like not a bad not terrible i'm still kind of yeah. like nah. I, i'm seeing everything I, my eyes are working good i'm just seeing myself flying and and it's just like a stimulus response and this thing kind of like i don't know like it has like legs that is holding me and now it just kind of like putting me in its peak yeah and kind of like ate me yeah chewing oh yeah okay i hear bones yeah like crunchy things crunchy crunchy little cracker <laughs> that's um I'm, I, I, I feel gooey, like just, yeah. Yeah. just like, I don't know what to feel. That's, that's I, I don't know that's what I'm feeling. 99.5 percent. You're almost there. You're doing great. Um, I don't know what I'm feeling. I'm just that. And you can test this at home once you get good at it. Especially those of you that are doing bodies of light uh, classes all around the world. That. I don't know. I see. I, I see. I, I'm floating in the air. Yeah. I'm out of body. Yes. You're 100 percent. Is there anything else you want to say about all that? Uh, no. Okay. Well, I only have one question. Are you willing to let go of all that dark energy? I am willing to let go of all dark energy. Okay, great. So now, what he's going to do now, get going, and he is going to, very simply, he's going to uh, let go of the dark energy, uh, I forgive you, I forgive me, and then he is going to um, do buys the light to finish filling up. So he'll, he'll release that subscara. Um, he's getting close to releasing his entire dark core and then we're going to have another uh, Buddha on the planet which is an enlightened being of light without a dark core. Now we do have good news in uh, next next uh, week I think we're going to talk about super babies but we saw one recently on like People magazine oh, yes. and that's actually a good thing because on the positive side well, first of all, let's talk about before, before Earth technology. He was actually, they had some nice lasers and stuff there that could be very utilized for something. Yeah, right? very cool. For, I mean, not probably not fighting off the dragons, but... Right, but yeah, but I mean, there. yeah, the thing like is, is that... Out the, I don't know, meteors in the sky or something. Yeah, like I mean, there's, there's, you know, they're all different, and, and we don't know if he had the, that, that lifetime, if he had much of that technology. But, um, but the cool thing is, is he's very close to releasing his dark core, and we saw an amazing person who... Uh, her voice is very high vibrational. She sings a lot, uh, Christina Aguilera. Yeah. And she, of course, I think is eating really good food and, and taking supplements. You can tell she's so shiny. She's, she's, see, a lot of people intuitively do what makes them feel good. And they, they're buying supplements and eating juice drinks and taking care of themselves. And for her specifically, she's doing a lot of singing. And uh, what's great is that her last child which is summer rain, uh, tests a billion trillion and has no dark core, which means is a reincarnated Buddha or enlightened being. And it's only a few of those babies on Earth. Not, right not a lot at all. There's, there's about 300,000 that we were feeling that are waiting to come. Yeah. Um, but you understand that the vessels really aren't here. So from the viewpoint of toxins, when you have people's DNA, which is really low, when you have the, the there's no food, the, the food is bad, and then and people's energy is low, um, you're not giving the vessels for the super babies and for these enlightened beings to reincarnate on the planet. There's well over 300,000 waiting, you know, waiting for us to evolve our planet to higher and better form, waiting for us to bring bodies of light, uh, and wait to raise our vibration, and waiting for us to allow. Uh, allow the masses in the entire world to learn testing because when they learn testing then they're going to eat better and the testing is part of when you learn to test and you do things above a 10 you are doing things that are high vibrational and that is the path into the light 
Um, so uh, I actually want you to bring me one of those sheets because everyone here is at a point now where you can become a league member of the League of Lightworkers International. And that's what's great about everything that we learned today. And I'm gonna show this. And what this is, is a unanimous, and everyone repeat after me, this is a unanimous declaration of the League of Lightworkers International. And you repeat at home, and you're gonna become part of this very elite society, and it's a society wherein we are helping each other learn these capabilities and techniques and you can do this, uh, have, a, have a light party at home and have everyone become part of the League of Lightworkers International at home. So wherever you are, have this party and have a good time. But repeat after me. Unanimous declaration, Unanimous declaration of League of, League of Lightworkers, of Lightworkers International. International. One. One. <laughs> As a league member, as a league member, I proclaim and promote, I proclaim, I proclaim and, promote and promote the undeniable, the undeniable personal, freedom personal freedom and free exercise, and free exercise of all light working techniques, of all light working techniques, techniques across, all parts, earth, across all parts of earth. Across all parts of earth. Two. As a league member, as a league member I, attest I attest that I am on a path into the light and will follow that path higher and higher and higher and higher and higher continually and honestly. Three. As a league member, as a league member I, attest I attest that I will bring in, in light that, that I will bring, bring in light, light on a daily basis, a daily on a daily basis, basis with bodies of light, with with bodies of light and any other light working techniques. And any, any other light working, light working techniques. Technique. Four. Four. As a league member, as a league member, I will earnestly strive, will earnestly strive to live a life, to live a life of high vibrational living. Of high vibrational living. Only eating foods, only eating foods that are ten plus. That are ten plus. Doing activities, doing activities that are ten plus. That are ten plus. And promoting, and promoting ten plus things. Ten plus things. To the effect, to the effect of a brighter world, of a brighter world for all. Of us. For all of us. Five. Five. As a league member, as league member, I will help others. I will help others. Bring in the light. Bring in the light. Heal themselves with light. Heal themselves with light. Test their foods with light. Test, Test their foods with light. Heal others with light. Heal others with light. As well as encourage others. As well as encourage others. To help others more. To help others more. To the effect. To the effect. Of a truly enlightened earth. Of a truly enlightened earth. And beyond. And beyond. Love it. Yeah. If you said that and you meant it, you're ready to become a league member and it's free to join. Just go to lightworkerseye.com, sign up and also sign up at bodiesoflight.net. Make sure and get the Bodies of Light book as well as the Bodies of Light audios. And on there it asks what you're willing to do to help others to spread the light you know, get in touch with us. We are ready to get this out to the world in over 22 languages. We're willing, we're holding the vibration, and we're happy. And we're, I, I want mm -hmm. to point out yes. that we're asking you to say bodies of light in addition to anything or everything that you already do. Anything else. We're not telling you give up anything, yes. don't go in any other direction, believe only us. We're mm -hmm. saying in addition to your belief systems and what you're already bringing right. in the light with. Yeah, because the whole thing is this, is that this is just increasing your vibration and making things faster. There's a billion ways to bring in the light. There's right. many ways to bring in the light. It's just how fast you want to do it. Right. So it's bodies of light and any other light working techniques. So anything that is positive with bodies of light. We just want you to do this every day so you're supercharging and so you're feeling tingly and have the energy to test and do the parts of the system which <laughs> continue you on your path into the light mm -hmm. and we are willing to have help we're willing to have help um, get bodies of light in all the languages you know we of course are doing translations in Hebrew um, Ukrainian Russian we've been doing Spanish um, Portuguese and I want to do sign language oh goodness yeah we definitely need to do sign language but we need help you understand it's not our karma to get this to the whole planet so if you think I'm gonna do it or we're gonna do it we're not 
with We're, your help? Yeah, or? if you gotta help us. So it's like, you understand that things have changed the world, they gotta have like some push. They need to have some flow. You know, things that are all over the world are there because they've had flow and money and help and things to get them there. You understand that this is like a, a treasure, like the Hammurabi's treasure in a cave. It just is, is Earth ready for it? Are we ready for that next great leap? Are we ready over the next two years to, to teach testing across the whole planet to go in the right direction, to go into light and love, to bring us together? Because in, like she was saying, what we are is light workers. You see, light brings us together. We love everything. You know, so Dubai is light and anything else. You understand those traditions out there that say you got to do this and you can't do anything else and you can't think for yourself and you can't do that. Those are usually dark. <laughs> because the darkness separates us. The darkness makes us feel alone. The light brings us together as one. The light lets us know that all religions and all viewpoints and all ideologies are really the same. That we're here to love everyone. We're here to evolve to higher, greater heights. I, I don't know how else to say it, except that, you know, this, is, this video has gone longer than we thought, but, you know, we <laughs> automatic talk. We're plugged into higher consciousness, all three of us. N none of us have a dark core. Um, and we're going to have a lot of fun with, uh, with you next week with super babies because of course he wants to bring in about you know a dozen i think well, we just we got want a, him to bring we want him to bring in a dozen <laughs> super babies <laughs> because he's like so high and you know, of course he's healthy he's chicken, chipping now like in a pack i know we're like we're like we're gonna get a little we're gonna he's gonna have this short bus with all the children because you know there's so many of these like christine aguilera has this super baby he's so healthy and he knows how to test he he, he wants to find his little uh you know, the, the girl who's ready to be on the path into the light with them and, and create a vessel for, you know, like, I know normally you don't want to have like, you know, 10 or 12 or 20 children unless you're bringing in, unless you're like super high and you're, you're trying to bring in these super, super beings to change the planet. But other than that, we need to kind of lower it lower. But I know you want to have, have uh, you know, help some of these super babies to come through. We're going to be talking about that next week. Yeah. So keep, stay tuned. Um, Super Babies is going to blow you away. Uh, is there anything else you want to say? Yes. Or? Please learn testing. This is as it's hard so as simple. it is. It's so simple. You know. <laughs> all we want for really you. Important. Yeah. All we want for you is your best life. Yeah. We want you to be healthy and happy and contribute to a healthy and happy planet. In a better world for all of us. Because you're just going to feel great at all times when you do the right thing. When you eat right, when you do the right decisions, when you hang out with the right people, yeah. you're just going to feel good. You're not going to be able to drain, you'll be like super excited and energized and motivated at all times. Yeah. So just something to look forward to and stop being this lower being that is not taking care of yourself and not living the you're, life you're, you're this super be being of light. We want you to shine. Let's get rid of this dim thing. It, it's <laughs> turn into a Buddha in 13 minutes. Dubai is light every day. Be on the path in the light. Only eat foods that are above a 10, only do things that are above a 10, and join the League of Lightworkers International and have fun with us and come hang out with us it's and fun. do the events and help <laughs> us. Anyone, come on, anyone of those that have the publishing contacts, we have a bunch of languages we need help in, um, get in touch with us. Huh? Let's bring up that. Yeah. Let's help the others. I mean, if, if, you, if you know somebody who doesn't speak English, we have a different dishes. We have a yeah. different Russian dish. We have it yeah. in Spanish. And, and many more languages will come through with your help. Yeah, we need help to get yes. us in a lot of languages. And so we need help. Karma. You'll feel great when you do the right thing, especially yeah. helping the humanity, helping a lot of people across yeah. the globe. You will feel great and good things will come towards you. Amazing as, things. As you will attract the good things in, as a reward for your great deeds. That's so true. So it's all good. Something to look forward to. Awesome. Thank Have you fun. for being here. Peace. <laughs> Bye for now. <laughs>